Hi, Eddie. Hope you're doing. My name is Mr. Fruit, and welcome to Darkest Dungeon 2. Did a video on this a while ago when it first released in early access, but 1.0 is here, the full release. I'm super excited. I played it a good bit because this video is a little late. However, when it came out was when I was super sick and unable to, like, literally talk. So I streamed it a little bit as a mute. And, yeah, the first, like, week and a half I couldn't talk. So, now I'm getting to it because I want to show you all the game because I really enjoy it. Even though it's a bit of a, uh, how you say, ball buster. Darkest Dungeon is about making the most of a bad situation. You are expected, or rather not, expected to succeed on your first expedition. Heroes will die. Failure will abound. The world will seek to smother you. Take heart. I, that doesn't really motivate me. At least they try and, you know, let you know immediately. But like, bam, you don't even get to the title screen. So, some people probably hop on like, oh, pff, how bad could it be? It's it's rough. And I'll show you exactly why in, 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 a, in a second. Here's all this new stuff or something. I don't know why it's making me. Hey, I have no exclamation marks. All right, we're headed in. That's the meta progression area where you get candles. Hold on, this thing is like so quiet. One second. Yeah, that's a bit better. Yeah, it's the meta progression, but this one's sort of different. Yeah, it is. It's 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 an iteration on the first one. It's not just like copy paste, but the second. So here's what I want to talk about. All right, you got to complete your confession. There's five different ones. You unlock them after you beat them. First one, denial, obviously. First try, boom, bam. Thank you, ma'am. It was close, but I made it the whole way. Beat the boss, easy. GG, go next. I've been stuck on this one for a while. Like, a while. I I don't even know how many runs at this point. Zero to a hundred. The amount of RNG that just gives you the good old dickin' is incredible. And what's incredible is I immediately just start a new run. I can't help it. It's incredible and infuriating. It's a magical mix. So we're headed into resentment because, again, I... Uh, don't really have any other choice. I need to beat it eventually. Part of it also, I should mention, I did get to the boss once. Final boss, bam. And I'm talking like two turns from victory. Dead, wiped. Like a seven hour run or something. Just <laughs> sucks to be me, huh? And then, you know, I kept going. The announcer also in this game is worth it alone so i i have all the current characters unlocked um in fact there's a new one that was with the 1.0 release the flagellant 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 i don't really know here's, here's the problem when i was fighting the boss i'm going in blind i don't want to know anything of course but there's a bit of a mechanic i won't spoil it but long story short I needed a certain type of rank damage, which my team severely lacked at the time. And that's what cost me the game. Had I known, I could have prepared. And I probably would have won that run. But again, I, I went in blind, as I prefer to do. You know, what's the fun? Might as well. I, I mean, that's the point of a roguelike, right? Some people like to play a roguelike, but expect to not lose. They like to win. But like, hey, yo. It's a roguelike. I'm okay losing because that's part of the experience. Part of the experience is running into something and being like, oh, I don't know what's going to happen. Oh, now, well, now I know for the next run, you know, surprise me. I get it. Some people don't like that, but I enjoy the challenge. And I like the fact that I've lost so many times. Now, granted, I'd like to go to the next confession, <laughs> but I'm learning. We're unlocking things. I keep getting destroyed it's great it's great so first off what we need to look at is everybody's quirks because they're random and sometimes they're negative or positive or so good you should either just always take them or not for instance the highwayman in a certain map he's a good chance to get some extra dodge however combat start he's dazed which means he'll move last that round and 50% chance every round start that he's vulnerable. 
means he just takes 50% more damage. That's pretty garbage, I'm gonna be honest. The Grave Robber has Blight Resistance, but 50% chance to be blind. Wow, these are all hot garbage. Incredible. The Plague, the Plague Doctor. Combat round scouting. Mm, less likely a positive relation chance. It's it. The Man at Arms. Good resolution chance. Not so much positive. Negative blight resistance. The Hellion. Uh, okay, let's let's just look for something that's really good. That's really bad. Don't really care. Oh, depends on good. Okay. Kind of like the Jester. He's always been a fun one for me. So, boom, Jester. Love it. After the, final the Leper, has been which I've been told isn't very good, but I played him some, of course. 20% max for HP. Oh, sheesh. Melee skills, 3% less chance to crit. Well, pretty much all melee skills. A little unlucky. The Occultist, I must admit. I don't think, I don't think I've actually used him. Botor, the Pillager. The Vestal. A cool, I've, I've used her a good bit. Cool. Okay. And, oh, okay. And the Fledgelent. See, I, I would normally take, like, the Highwayman, for instance. Or in this one, maybe the Grave Robber would be nice. They both have... But... but, 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 but for perks. I am going to throw the Plague Doctor in as our healer slash support. Real solid. It's always a toss-up between this and the Vestal. But... Um, I'm opting for the Plague Doctor. Now we need a front line. And the man at mar the man at arms, real good at that. Could do the Hellion, or even frankly the the flag flag flagell flagellant flagell. How do I not actually know? I just this isn't a bit. Legit flagell. This dude, Damien, um, can be frontline. He uses his own HP to heal people or heal himself. Pretty fun. I don't know if it's a good idea, but it's there. And he does a lot of blight. And the Plague Doctor does some blight. Maybe there's something there. We really need a ranged character, though. That does ranged damage. The Jester doesn't really do... Uh, and not a not a sing not a single damaging but the, but the the gestures uh he's frankly he's my crutch especially for reducing stress but nothing to, I've never used the runaway I don't don't actually know entirely what you do uh not the damage I'm looking for does anyone, does anyone have the? Anyone help me? You, I don't even. You can't even hit the back line. Uh, you don't. What about? Okay. He. Uh. Okay, but you you do damage to other people. Then I guess you're a healer. Well, you have one thing that heals. Target has to be pretty weak. 100% crit heal. An upgrade. When you have two or more fists. So I have to combo a lot. Which the Jester's good at setting up combos. It's true. This is true. You know what? Screw it. Boom. Occultist. Jester. There's some range damage. A little bit of healing. Granted, not much. But it's something. And, again, I've used, like, Highwayman in every single one of my runs. So. It'd be a bit weird. If we don't. Who else is good with, like, combos? I think the Leper is. The problem with the leper, 
he does big damage, but then he almost always like guarantees to blind himself. You ignore the blind if they're comboed, but sometimes that's much easier said than done. Tempting to just have the man at arms do his thing, which is to say, front line and take damage for people. But you know what? That's what he's going to do. He's got a path. What is this? Less skill damage. Extra shield attack damage. What does this give? Less damage. Extra resistance. Well, that just seems bad. I'm not really using you for damage. Shield attack. Plus resistance. Stand fast skill. Oh! Wait, stand fast skills. What are... How do I know what... Stand fast. Um, oh, wow, I'm not even remotely close. Dodge. That would have been cool because he taunts, uh, which would ensure that people attack him, but whatever. All right, so the next up, we are going to go. I'm thinking let's do some flagellant. flagellant. Although you're like our only ranged. Man, this is what I'm saying, man. Give me the... I might just go highway, man. I'll be honest. Even though his... The thing is, there is a chance that we find a doctor and we can remove this. All right? I think that's what I'm going to bank on. Just, just seems right. Feels good. Path we want to give you is... Do we give you extra ranged, less melee? But we don't really want to do that. We... Good. Well, you know what? We'll do rogue. So essentially, if you're in the front, you get some extra damage. If you're in the back, not so much. Seems good to me. You get extra HP, extra speed, less resistance hits. Ah, you're fine. The occultist don't have one. Great. All right. So that took a while, as it usually does. But now we're headed in. We got our team. I'll try and give you an overview of what the fudge we're doing. First off, vroom vroom, I'm in my own coach wagon, stage wa wagon coach, sto stage wagon, stage coach. But you are not having difficulty alone. with exist. Oh, what's this? Ah, oh, what, 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 what do we got going on here? Whoa! Oh, so you obviously didn't see this, but between runs, my last run, I used my candles, which is the meta progression thing, to buy things. And when you unlock things in the next run, you'll start with those. So it's random, but we already got a lot of stuff. And I don't remember what we got. So let's find out together. We got a heal that does stress in people. All right. It's a combat item. So you guessed it. We can use it during combat. This is a trap or something, but we can make people bleed. This is a, a very rare trait. It's legendary, indelible. When stress damaged, heal 33% with a 10% chance. That seems pretty good to me. I'm honest to you. Maybe put that on Barristan because he should be taking most of the hits. Well, ideally. Turn end uh, either faster or possibly dazed. Round start. Dodge. And, uh, 10 healing re received from skills per positive token. If diseased, lost minus HP. What about this? If stained item is equipped, turn start a blind times two. If blind, 66% crit. I guess it would have been good if I took leper. I didn't. But who wants this? I mean, crit's cool, but blind, not mistaken, is literally just 50% chance to miss every attack. Is that really worth it? This gives resistance and less damage per negative token, whatever. What's this? Healing given, healing reset. I'm going to put it on him for the memes, 
for once, but I think that's a terrible idea, frankly. Uh, you give extra healing. If flammable item is equipped. Uh, I don't think any of you have that. I don't know. Uh, or extra healing or something. You can perhaps be invisible. You get, uh, sure, and you get that. Okay, wow, look at all the trinkets. All right, we didn't even start, and already everything's confusing. According as we gave them things, that'll make them stronger. But the way the games work, it do be a roguelike. Um, with permadeath and all that good stuff. Like, these characters will die if they die. The objective is to make it to the mountain, the summit, whatever. Find whatever confessional boss there is and beat them. Push back the blight or whatever this, like, spooky, not good, missed stuff is. Easier said than done, of course. And then we have combat, which is turn-based, as well as rank-based, with everyone's abilities. And also reminds me, I forgot to actually change their abilities because you can unlock more. Each character has X amount of abilities. You can take up to five, blah, blah, blah. There's all this stuff. A lot of them interact, for instance, like this one. So it's a melee attack, which I can use right now. But if I were in the fourth slot, I wouldn't be able to. So it depends. Some people will have access to some, depending on where you put them. But a lot of the times, certain people like to be in certain places, like man at arms likes to be in the front. Healers usually like to be in the back. Go on, so forth. Each attack has uh, a secondary effect. We're gonna whack things, all that good stuff. So, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna start off by hitting up one of these ghouls because it'll push me back. Wow, which is good because then his next ability pushes him forward again, and it combos, which. I'll show you combo stuff here soon. We got our boy Man at Arms. This dude's going first, but he's blinded, so we'll just pray that that works out. Um, our good boy Man at Arms, though, can defend others. So I don't know. Maybe I'm worried Highwayman's going to take some damage. I gave him a buff, uh, which means for the next two times, Man at Arms is going to take the damage instead. Now I got to read essentially what this guy does because I don't. I just kind of picked him. So he does damage with a melee. That makes sense. He's got a ranged with a chance to combo an enemy. Got one to debuff an enemy and guaranteed to combo them. Interesting. He has the healing. And then he has an ability to pull some people and combo them. That's pretty good. So, just realize now, I guess, I guess I don't really have that many people that want, could have probably built a better combo team. I didn't realize this dude set up so many combos. That's new to me. But see, ready? Bah! In with a little damage, boom, pull him up. And so here's the whole combo. Nonsense. He has a combo debuff. Which means if I use a skill that can benefit from combo, when it hits him, it'll do that and consume the token. This guy's blighted, unlucky. There are elemental effects that do damage over time. That's what happened there. I meant to change your abilities, but... So for instance, pistol shot. My target will be dazed if they're comboed. And again, like that's pretty much it. Again, I... Probably could have picked a better combo oriented team, but that's okay. So instead, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna just whack this dude. Oh, and we crit because I have that item. Ah, it worked out. So now I'm gonna roll up combo. And then we're playing this little hopscotch nonsense. Yeah. This guy's gonna move here? I don't think so. Boom, comboed, dazed, which puts him at the end. Never mind, he resisted. Forget what I said. We could pull somebody. Or, ah, uh, see, we can't hit him. I don't know if we'll be able to kill. 
I'm not in range for my melee attack. So instead, I'll just hit you. Oh, it hits two people? Ooh, I like that. Oh, I like that a lot. AoE damage. And it's seemingly a good amount of AoE damage. You don't typically see that. Don't you dare. Light resist. Let's go. Empowered. Emboldened. Now, there's a whole bunch of mechanics, too, to the fighting, which I'll get to when they occur. There's, like, stress levels, resolution chances, blah, 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 blah. But just know, gold things are buffs for me or enemies. If it's not gold, it's probably debuff. Most of the time. And yeah. Um, so this, that dude is about to attack. And I can't reach him. But Man at Arms gets to heal a little bit off a of combo. And a little relationship play, which I'll get into after this match, if I remember, which I probably won't. And let's be honest. But see, this has 10, oh, 10% crit chance because it's if I'm blinded, which I'm confused because I'm not blind. Shouldn't I be? I don't know. Boom, you're dead anyway, though. A lesson taught is a lesson learned. Well said, announcer. Could not have said it better myself. Give him a little. He didn't bleed. That's incredible. All right, well, either way. Good thing. This is always the first battle, but for the for first end, never really struggled. Hopefully you don't. Burning Hopefully I never do that. That'll be embarrassing. But it's just a quick little A. Wet your palate. Let you know. Get a little bit of stuff and get on your way. Perhaps realize your team's shortcomings like I, I have quite quickly. So our highwayman, this is a stained item, which lets us use this. So, turn start. Blind times two. Just trying to figure out why he's not being blinded. I don't know. Blinded by the light. Alright, we made it to our first end. So see, that's where we're going. Ooh. The mountain. Or the peak. Or I think it's the mountain. I don't know. Lower your guard. <laughs> the guard. It is safe here. Okay, so you reduced the stress. Lovely. So to start, we have a mastery trainer. Wow, mastery. Yeah, that's so cool. Which you gain mastery points depending on people you fight, objective you complete, bosses, blah, blah, blah. You're just going to pass with your run. Which lets you upgrade abilities once. You can only upgrade an ability once. But you'll see the top of the description, that's what it does now. And the bottom is what it will do if I upgrade it. So, for instance, this one. If I upgrade it, goes from 4 to 7 damage to 6 to 8 damage. And I heal more on a combo. Right? That's the gist of it. While I'm here, I need to remember to change the Highwayman's skills. Because I've unlocked all of his. One super good one is called Highway Robbery. Because if the target has a positive token, I remove them. Or if I upgrade it, I steal them. I'm like, oh, you have buffs? No, I have buffs. Love it. Big fan. We are going to be using him a little bit more for melee. But because of the path I put him on, point blank shot here, uh, gives us repost, which is essentially if we get hit, we hit back. Um, but we have to be in the front line, the front rank in order to use this. So I need to guarantee I use Duelist Advance because it's the only way I can move myself forward. And then I just kind of play back and forth between man at arms. This will give us some bust, but probably not going to do that. What else do we want? Double taps, a good high damage range to avoid some death blows or death resistance. Nor some stuff. Wicked slice, just good melee. I might do. Grape shot is a good AoE. This makes uh, somebody vulnerable, though. That's fun. Love that. Do I have any skills that really interact with combos? That'll knock back somebody. And this will bleed somebody. Maybe that. And I think you can use one more skill. So we have move forward, shoot, 
You should go for something that can hit the back line. But then I'll take pistol shot. Okay, great. Now, I remember relationships. So each character converses and talks amongst each other. And depending on whether they have a positive relationship or a negative relationship can determine whether or not they get a relationship effect, whether or not something happens. And it's pretty self-explanatory. Positive relationship, nice. Negative relationship, not nice. And it'll affect skills in a way that like, if I have a positive relationship with Baristan, our man-at-arms, one of my skills, if I use it, will give man-at-arms a positive effect. And man-at-arms will have an ability that gives me a positive effect, back and forth, back and forth. But the same happens with negative, sometimes if I use something. And so it can really hurt you too if they're skills you use a lot. Um, but they can also compound, so you would like to get positive relationships, but easier said than done. And that's something you need to know about the game, especially if you're going to play it. There's a lot of RNG. That's just part of the game. Sometimes it'll go in your favor. A lot of the times it's not. And that's part of this game. It like leans into it, the punishing RNG. So you got to roll with the punches, accept what it is. Sometimes, you know, you just couldn't be more unlucky. I've been there. So for our highwayman, I kind of want to take highway robbery immediately because I like to steal the tokens. Jester has some really good abilities, but I don't know what you do. Gain on killing blow. Okay. Um. Well, that's. Oh, oh, I see. Okay. Trying to figure all this out. Um, don't worry about that. And pull. I kind of like. Wait, what's the one that hit both? This one. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think we can do that. Some good backline damage right now, you know? We'll be able to get some more later. Uh, you have end items that you can only use at the end, um, which you can use on your people, which give them positive effects. So like this, we'll give some, somebody 20% max HP until the next end. That's our front line. So we'll use it there. And then of everybody here, Dismas or Highwayman would probably be getting hit the most. So we'll give it to you. There's a Provisioner where you can use currency to buy things and also equip things to your, your wagon. I'm going to grab the Radiant Flame and the Orphan Wolf Club. You go over to the Wainwright. You can equip a flame, which in my case, this flame gives us a lot of good stuff. We like that. And then different pets. I haven't unlocked very many. They always show up at the first end. Once you put them on, you can't take them off the rest of the run. This essentially just increases our chances at positive relationships. More so if we have certain items on our stagecoach. Now, I'm not rushing to use any of my money right now. I'll check. Like, this one, for instance, can make specific targets more friendly to each other. This one has a chance of doing a lot of positive, but some negative. But, boom. Just realized, 12 coin for a wild T, which removes a negative quirk. 25% chance to remove a positive, but that's worth it. It, it actually t t hit the 25% chance. All right, so he has no quirks, but he doesn't have that negative. So now suddenly, we're vibing. And I'm not going to buy anything else. Screw it. Provinces and so, now we move to the next one. Crumbling. You don't and technically undone. see it. You will in a second, but think of this like Play the Spire and all the other roguelike games. I sort of have a map with like a path that winds, and you have to choose. So this one, we have to choose if we want to go to the Shroud or the Sprawl. Different enemies... Different area, different rewards, blah, blah, blah. But what I mainly pay attention to is each one will have um, certain effects. So if we go to the Sprawl, there'll be more path choices. Then the goal is to clear out the lair. And if you complete the goal, then when you get to the next end, you get the reward. So we would get this indelible trinket. For this one, if we fight six or less road battles, we'll get a mastery point. And this one gives us better resolute chance. Now, 
I mean, oof, I do like that indelible trinket. Not gonna lie to you. We have to make sure to clear out the lair here. Which is not fun. It's really not. Another nameless city. Another inferno of mutilation. Really worth it. Yeah, screw it. That's what we'll do. And we head off. Um, right here is where people would show up as having a positive or negative relationship. Do note that those only last from end to end. If I were to make it to the next end, those relationships go away, whether positive or negative. And then they like re-roll when you go into the next area. Pretty much anything you give, buffs, debuffs, whatever, are end to end. Not like the entire run. Something to note. But I just love the vibe, even though it's depressing, I guess. Dark. But the art style is great. It's fun, addicting. Again, ball busting. Behold. The great cities Behold. So here's the more obvious roguelike map you've sort of seen. This one shows the actual choices. Um, you have a chance at scouting what it is. So like we learned that this is a watchtower, just had a chance. We failed to, you know, see a lot of these things. Now what we have to look out for is this, the lair. If I want to complete our quest. So we need to make it to the lair, which means it looks like I have a pretty flexible path to it. I'm very tempted to hit up the Hero Shrine, because the Hero Shrine is how you unlock new abilities on characters. Which I am a fan of, however, we'd have to go through Oblivion Terror, which increases the loading, which is a whole thing. And that also, so we'd be at two loading? Well, that's... So if we go in the lair, we're going to go there, and then the final one. And... Screw it. All right, so we'll head to the right. Now you can control the stage, wa the stage wagon as well. Skirt, skirt. Um, watch me. There's not a lot to it, but each time you hit these little like objects that are on the road and whatever area you are, it's different. You have a chance at getting some loot and stuff, so you know, might as well. And it's a little mini game; keeps you engaged. I like it. All right, so we got the burning pile, which I'm pretty sure is just yep some enemies. So. Our man at arms is ready to fight. And if we choose his option, he increases his relationship with the highwayman and the occultist. Same thing for these guys. So I'll just go with man at arms. All right. So we get to start with our jester. Now it's important to take note of this dude in the back, the sacrificial. Every turn he's gonna move to the front. If at any point he's in the front rank, he explodes. There's a lot of damage to everybody. Real bad. So we want to make sure he can't do that. Whether or not we'll be able to do that at, like immediately, well, probably not. But let's start off. This guy has a dodge. He can dodge. So I'm going to maybe steal that drink, uh, or a positive token. Six damage is a lot. An immediate burn and stress. Wow, that's... Okay, but we are blinded, which might seem bad, but also gives us real good crit chance. 76% chance to crit, which would give us an amount of damage. I'm not entirely sure, but don't worry about it. We're going to hit. We hit these. All right, so may maybe I just take, take that trinket off. Okay, but this does good AOE damage in the back. This guy, of course, is Omega Armor. Empowered. Why wouldn't Emboldened. But see, now Barristan can hold the line and move forward if he wanted to. But I want to use Point Blank Shot, so I'm not going to. Instead, we block for somebody. Or mm, give him a good old whack. We're not gonna kill anybody, but that's alright. Cause he's gonna miss. Ah, oh, swing and a miss, stupid. And you're gonna hit that, but you didn't bleed us, stupid. And they're gonna move forward. The flaming spreads. 
All right, we might be blinded, but if we hit this point blank shot, which is complete overkill now that I look at it, because five health, we do like 28 damage or something with a crit, which is insane. But again, they're already weak, so that doesn't... And you have dodge. Okay, I didn't really think this was doing. Okay, actually, a blind and dodge, I'm 100% guaranteed to not hit. So let's try this one. A miscalculation, perhaps. Yep, thinking maybe we take that one off. You can jump forward. If you high roll, you kill. Mm, now I'm getting damaged. Get rid of your, uh, your arm. You're already combo. That's not the biggest biggest deal. Um, I will be able to actually just kind of sort of keep knocking him back, though, so it's not the worst. We, of course, low rolled and didn't kill. Love that. You're buffing them. Don't love that. Get a highway robbery. But... Well, I'm going to hit you both. Holy critical for 11 damage. Doses. Oh, nice miss. Oh, and a repost. Stupid. Hit me again. What are you doing? Healing yourself? Pfft. Why are you going to move again? Don't matter. Kaboosh. If you're curious, that's the, deep, the the buff I had for post. I get hit. I get to attack back. Alright, I'm just going to freaking... Get this one over with. We are a little weak. Love that. Actually, I can't. Okay, I debuffed him. But he has this dodge thing. All right, because we hit these. We do, in fact, not hit those. If you burn me, bleed! That's just annoying because that's residual damage we're going to keep after this fight that we could have possibly avoided had. Uh, killed him earlier. That's okay, you're blinded. And I still can't hit you. Bit of an oversight. Yeah, this dude can't hit the front at all. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, fine, I'll just move you. Which allows this dude to come in and freaking Pia! Alright. Not bad. Again. That one shouldn't have been the death of us. Speaking of death, though, sometimes in those random encounters, death, and I mean literally death, will show up as a random mini-boss chance. Ruined my run, ran I, I had a good run going. Killed that, I'm like, oh, sweet, death shows up out of nowhere. Dude's cracked. Lost that one. But yeah, it's great, you know, it's just sort of gamba. Sometimes maybe a little too much gamba, but gamba nonetheless. Now we're going to go right, because I want to go to the Hero Shrine. Even though the loathing will increase. I'll show you what that means in a second. If you also, the characters will sort of tell you which ones they prefer. If you choose the one they didn't want, your stress increases, because they're little boners. So the loathing, up here you'll see four icons. Means how far the loathing is. So currently only at one, which uh, drains our flame more, and enemies have a better chance of getting advantage at the beginning. The flame is... The thing on the wagon that you see, the higher the flame, the better we are. We don't really get a lot of buffs, though, but the lower it is, the harder enemies get and, like, the more debuffs we get. They want to keep the flame up. It keeps hope alive, you know, all that stuff. So, anyway, here's a doctor, which can either lock in traits or remove bad traits. Sometimes you want to lock in a trait because something could happen and then it would disappear, sort of like, you know... If I had ha if I had locked his positive, the item would have tried to remove it, and then it couldn't have. Um, I really don't quite know what Neat Freak is, but it I feel like it could run us into some trouble. So I'm just gonna remove it. As far as the pharmacy goes, do I want to buy any items? This is like the best healing combat item. I am inclined to buy that, and then for that, ah, uh, shit, will be done. Good enough for me. Now, I'll give the healer the healing items as well. Mine as well. Your and wait. that's pretty much Press it. Onward. Okay, great. Ooh, the hero shrine. Uh, what the fuck is going on? Which 
you want to go to. So his stress is reduced. Very fun. I'll show you exactly what the hero shrine is. No shot. Okay, so we didn't know what that was. Random chance of anything. It was loathing. Now we're going to hit three loathing here. Why is that bad? What happens when you get four? Well, I'll tell you. It resets the loathing, except the final boss of this whole thing gets like 20% extra max HP every time. You don't want max loathing. We're already going to be at three. I like never hit three. For me. Anyway, it's trying to reflection. You get to view people's backstories. In doing so, you can unlock new abilities. Now, I need to see... I think Man at, or Highway Man is the only one I've fully unlocked. Gesture I'm close to. Man at Arms, not at all. Maybe I should... While I'm at it, though, I need to remember. I do kind of want to do different skills. This hits two targets. And bleeds them. That can move a target back and protect them. And this can pull somebody. And make them go forward again. Let's do that. But I think I'll go man at arms because I don't have any of his abilities. I'd like to see what they are. Man at arms. Chapter one. A premature promotion. He's dead inside, just like me. He's just like me for real. The politics of a military career are perhaps as treacherous as war itself. Though untested in combat, his acumen for advancement was unmatched. Through a dubious campaign of influence and intimidation, he had at last claimed a coveted command and was eager to bask in the glory of the victories that were sure to come. That was part one. Everybody has five parts. Some of them will just tell you stories, sort of reveal in a narrative, but then some of them are battles where you're essentially reliving some part of their story. And it, all five parts are one story and it sort of culminates at the end. Each time you get a new ability. We got Bellow. They can do from any rank and hits all enemies, which removes repost and makes them slower. Interesting. Not terrible. I don't run into that many reposters. Not a word. Um, yeah, I kind of just like what we got, frankly. But that means now if we go again, we'll get the next ability, so on and so forth. So early game, especially, you want to go to as many hero shrines as possible so you can unlock everything for everybody. Because again, Highwayman's the only one I have fully unlocked. Everybody else is like... Well, just like, like that was my... Most of them actually don't even have any. So, I try and hit all the hero shrines I can because, again, I'm in the early game. I need unlocks. And here is the... Oh, no, this is just a battle, not the lair yet. Is this the lair? No, I don't think so. So, Man at Arms actually wants to run. If we do, we lose gold, but we don't fight. However, the cultists will be upset. You also want to... Same thing. The occultist, however, wants to fight. But both of them don't like that. So I think, actually, I'm going to do the man at arms. Uh, oh, minus two, though? Ugh. We didn't have to fight him, which can be good or bad. Could be good because, I don't know, who knows, maybe you get something really good from the encounter, like the reward. But never hurts to just... You... Are you, again, completely random. Believe it or not, there are a lot of things that these routes can be. Onward, while there is still time. And what, like four out of the five we've done have somehow been loathing. Like I said, RNG, baby. Yeah, great, great start to this run. Freaking. And my flame is already at half. Jesus. Never that low. I don't have any way to increase it, though. There are some combat items you can use. But don't have those. And it's time for the lair. Oh, yeah. Spoilers. The lair's not easy. In fact, there's the three, 
three levels to this. The one battle, two battle, three battle. Each gets harder. There's a boss at this one. Now you get some cool stuff if you go, and it's a push your luck. I can beat one and leave. However, it'll show you what you do if you beat the second. And if you beat the second, it'll show you what you get with the third. And spoilers, third's always really good. However, I think for the quest, I think I need to beat the whole thing. Yeah, I said clear the lair, right? Not just visit the lair. No. Gotta work on that. First up, we have the shaman dude. Not a fan of that. I'm gonna try and... Should I just try and bleed these guys? Sure. Oh, big blade. So they'll take two damage at the start of their turn for three turns. So that's six damage in the long run. Now I'm gonna... Repost here, even though I'm blind. So I'm gonna hit this crit. I didn't even hit the crit. Wait, and that wasn't even the thing that shoots you. Alright, this trinket ain't worth it. Alright? And I, yes, I forgot to take it off. Okay. He dodged that attack, but that's fine. We got the shaman. I didn't want to know what he was going to do to us. Whip, tip. Oh, fudge. Oh, okay. So they pulled my occultist forward. This debuff means we can't be moved. So, like, if the jester wants to move forward, he's stuck there for now. So, a little unfortunate. Nothing crazy, though. I think I'm just going to give... Actually, I'm going to push you back. Be gone, thought. Because sometimes they don't have, like, abilities that they can use depending on their... Um... Okay, well, he immediately just moved forward. For no... okay. You moved forward, too. I don't know what, I don't know what the fuck just happened. I need to get rid of your stuff, though. You will attack, and we'll probably miss. We actually hit through that. There's a 75% chance now. Wait. Wait, what the fudge? Wait, ain't no way. Hold on. This... That is news to me. So because you can't be moved, we went forward one, but I always assumed you wouldn't move because it's only one, so you'd be like, eh. But apparently you just you hop. I I didn't I never had to do that before, so that's that's yeah, news to me. Uh we're gonna kill you, hopefully. We have to kinda hire No, yeah, bleed. We're good no matter what. Yeah. Well, you'll die at the beginning of your turn. Stupid. And I'ma hit you with the freaking kaboosh. Bro, all you had to do was not completely low roll. And you know what you did? Completely low roll. And you missed. This freaking blind thing, bro. I'm taking it off. That cost a lot to unlock. Well, it's a later unlock. Like, what the fuck am I going to do with that, man? It's gamazed. Anyway. Guess I can move forward. Nice. You're dead, stupid. Now the occultist can do what he wants. So... I'm going to combo you so that man-at-arms can whack you and heal. Kaboom! Three damage though, my guy. Again, you, your range is like three to six. You can, believe it or not, hit for more if, if you so desire. All right, now. Don't. Hit. You stressed him out, man. You're stressing me out. Everybody's stressed. Thanks for nothing. Nice. Good crit. Good crit. You don't even need an item to crit. So see, do we want to go to the next one? Yeah. We go next. We got the flame thing again. Is all right. I'm going to try and bleed you both. Good crit. Bro, bro's critting left and right. And we, oh my God. And we combo. Whoa. Just draft my own heart. We got debuff, which is unfortunate. And of course, I have this freaking blind debuff. But again, it's okay because you're about to go. Maybe can I kill you? If I hit and crit, nope. Perfect. Love it. Love it. Freaking... Do your freaking. Okay, you die at the beginning of your turn. Okay, you got moved. Empowered. Right. Emboldened. Emboldened. 
Now who? Who? Get rid of your dodge. We missed, but I was kind of assuming we would. That's rude. But no debuff. Then you're gonna move ahead. Yeah, whatever. All right, now we're gonna move forward and combo them. Yeah, yeah. And then we're gonna hit him. You're getting awfully weak there, buddy old pal. Now we're gonna point blank shot and hit this. Ah, there we go. Okay, 19 crit when I finally hit something. A rarity to be sure, but a welcome one. The flaming spreads. Does it though? Because peep it. Boom. Knock him back. That's right. Uh uh uh. Not on my watch. And then I'm gonna hit him with a capital goo. Stay away, you fiend. I'm gonna heal off you. I do. I do. Like, let me let me peep. Wait, that doesn't make sense. Four to seven damage, my dude. How are you? Where's this coming from? How are you doing three every time? Am I missing something? Is it four, four, four to seven? Whatever. I'm gonna freaking hit. Oh, we actually hit through bind. Okay, wow. All right, but see, now next reward. Boom, dummy thick, right? This is like, eh. This is, yeah. Because here's something I didn't share. Again, there's a lot to this game. The trophy. You can put one trophy on your stagecoach, your stage wagon, whatever. Doing so gives you buffs. Obviously, like this one. Uh, when we crit, we put them on fire. But at combat start, there's a chance that I actually don't know if that's my team or everybody and get burned. I'm not really sure. But the reason you also want a trophy is because when you get to the end, the mountaintop, you actually won't fight the boss boss unless you have a trophy. So you could make it the whole way. Good run, but if you didn't go to one lair and beat the whole thing and get the trophy, you don't get to fight the final boss boss and complete the confession. I know, right? Anyway. We're just going to do it anyway. I, I don't know. I've lost this guy before. What is he going to do? Wipe me again? Or is he... he puts everyone on fire. On his ladder, he hates... He hates knowledge. He puts all these books on fire. Uh, and with those three bars, so he th attacks three times in a turn. So... Since I battled him before, I know what his moves are. So currently in the back, he'll do ranged... Uh, to hurt us, put us on fire, increase our stress... I think this one, either, no, I don't actually remember what that one does. Burnout, hits front two, he gets dodge, goes back, and we get burned. This one's super annoying, he does it all the time. Because typically what he does, he does smoke stack, or one of these that moves him forward, and he just keeps going back, 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 back. So, we gotta try and take this dude out. I could bring him forward. His, his, oh. He's immune to movement stuff, uh, apparently. Let us take a closer look Move at resist, 200 base. Essentially, we're not moving him. So that's not, that's not a viable strategy. Either is any of this. And oh, and the thing too is you don't want to, I made this mistake, that's how I wiped. You don't want to take out his books. Like I said, sometimes you just fight a mechanic and figure it out. Every time the books get destroyed, he actually becomes stronger. The part of it is he's trying to, like, burn the books. Yeah, it's a whole thing. A whole thing. Anyway, I... Can't really... Can't really do anything. Here. So, I'm going to try and pull him, even though it won't work. Just because I don't want to hit the books. Which, here, I'm going to do. But, it's to hit him. <laughs> Although, that's a lot of damage. Though. We can't even hit him. So, I 
I'm going to defend or heal. Just because he has no attack that hits the back line, so no point. You could move forward to get your repost, but all we can hit are these books, so screw it. Instead, we're going to hit through our blind. 100% taking the stupid thing off. So he's burning the pages, trying to bring him down. He's... What does this do? Oh, screw me. Okay. What are you doing? Oh, Jesus. He shuffles our party. That's... I love that. And he's still back here where I can't hit. Gotta move back. Lean back. And we can't... Bro. And I don't want to pass and do nothing because your stress increases. But actually, it might be our best move. Yellow. The cultist. Going to... He's just going to dodge this, isn't he? We're going to kill this stupid book. He dodged it, and all we did was hit the book. This is already going off. There goes one of the books. And there's the the team-wide AoE burn. Love that. Hopefully you know some sarcasm there. I don't love that. Yeah, but we, at least we hit him. Uh, oh, right. I'm protecting you. Now he's blinded. Sweet. He's burned for four. Sweet. And hopefully you're picking up the sarcasm here. Okay, the good news is he's the only one I can hit now. As long as he stays in that position. We've done like zero damage, so that's pretty good. You resisted the combo? Oh my. He's burning more books. Aye, aye, aye. Oh my god, I can't. Alright, screw this. I, I thought he moved to the front earlier, but I guess it's just every time the books. And if he ever gets to the front. What, Ro Raggy? Like, what? 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 You already hit through blind more times than freaking Highway Man. Debuff resisting. Nice. Uh, now we're gonna go forward. And we're gonna we're gonna miss. Love that. We're gonna go. Bloop, 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 hit him with some tentacles. So healthy. But now I can do what I want. By that, I mean, um, we hit him with things. I'm going to do that. Crit him for not much. But now I have a repost. He's, those books are, he is chewing through those. Now, of course it is. No, oh, I wanted to move forward and stop myself from being able to, but freaking Highwayman will be stuck there and he does nothing. I'm a swap. Please don't burn me. Six damage, so he's taking 18 more damage from burn alone. Of course, that's all of his health, so. Now this is going. I just take your positive token. Not like I'm gonna hit. Sure. Give me your enhanced dodge. Oh no, it's just regular dodge. Then we're gonna go. What is your bleed resistance? Pretty good. Okay, but I'm gonna combo you. Still resisted that. That's incredible. Okay. Requires target is less than 30. 100% crit. Mm. I could heal you for anywhere from 0 to 22. Oh my god. But apparently I'll also make you bleed. Alright. I'll do that next time. And things are a little more dire. Uh, so there goes that. Lucky. And he's just... Okay, he missed everybody, though, because of the blind. 
Huge blind. Everything hurts. Um, I can reduce your stress. And remove vulnerable. You don't have five plus, so I would remove the vulnerable. That's not right. I'm trying to get rid of your dodge. I'm blind. Yeah, I'm not hidden. 100% change that. All right, please don't kill him. Annoying, but okay. We are doing approximately zero damage. This is incredible. And simply incredible. You know what? Nah. I'm going to use our healing item first. Then I'm going to hit you with the... Gabba the ghoul! A crit! Nice! A oh, man. You're going to go forward and combo him, right? Oh my god, he comboed him. I don't know what to do. I never thought this day would come. I could bleed you for four. Oh, that'd be big. If we get through your resistance. Oh, ho, ho. we did. Measured and Off and off. Okay, he's getting low. He took a little bit of damage. He's getting very... One more turn. Oh, shit. That is... Oh, my... And the stress? Ay, ay, ay. And he has dodge. Sussy fucker. Uh, he dodged it. I can't hit him anymore, so... Interesting. Uh, I'm a... Ba, ba, back it up. Now, he's going to burn the page, isn't he? Ah, fudge. Okay. All right, well, it's game time. Uh oh, what are you doing? Wait, 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 wait. But no, oh, here it is. Every turn, AOE burn. I don't know why he healed. Well, GG. Ain't no way, right? And we missed. And he didn't like that? Oh my word. Uh. You might have more strength. He's about to have a freak out, which a meltdown. Yeah, we'll get to that, huh? A swing and a miss. Okay, and here it is. Well, at least it hit with that repose. AoE hit, yep. Good repose though. Something. Welcome to Death's Door, my friend. So when you run out of HP, you enter Death's Door. Enemies some enemies can do the same. Uh like for instance, this guy will. When at Death's Door, anytime you take fatal damage from there on out, you have a chance to resist it and stay alive or die. So if we look at uh, our friend here, he has 65 death. death resistance. So a 65% chance that the next hit that hurts him won't kill him, but a 35% chance that it will. And that's any damage, like even burn at the beginning of my turn. Very fun. Very fun. We love that. Um, I... I want to just do a little bit extra damage. But I'm going to reduce your stress so you don't have a meltdown right now. We can't really afford that. Now, I'm going to heal you. Oh. So you're off death's door. And I'm only using my item because we really need to damage. Large. Now, my point blank shot here, if I'm blind, which I'm not, could have maybe crit, whatever. This could... 15% chance to crit. Likely, no. But I'm here for it. He did crit. Okay, but a repost might kill you. Killed it. Killed it. Oh. Fine. I get... <laughs> no! Okay, okay, okay. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Nobody's on death's door yet. I mean, yeah, you're on death's door, but whatever. Two to three damage, my dude. You don't do nothing. Okay, we'll pass. We get stress, but it at least heals us a little bit because we might have died. Right? Okay, death's door. Oh, Jesus. Okay, so the reason why that's such a big problem is because the occultist is on fire, so he won't be able to heal himself. When his turn starts, sixty percent chance of that fire is just going to kill him. Or, well, 40% chance. 
really have to hope that's not the case. Like, really hope. The high roll a little more, my dudes. Okay, all right, he resisted. He is going to heal himself. Zero to, that's so weak. Five health. Oh my God. All right, we got two on death's door, but he's on death's door. You, and you're on death's door. Okay, 25% chance he resists this. That's low. We are beaten, we are bruised, we are battered, but we are alive. The spoils yes. Unparalleled power. Turn start. At first, in turn order, extra attack. Again, on killing blow, possible extra action. Uh, some fire stuff. Some, it was great. This is great. I love this. I love this for us. Not the fact that like everyone's on their deathbed and super stressed. Not, not you know, nice psyched about that part. Sure, whatever. All right, let's look at our trinket. Who is our speediest? You are, and it's not even remotely close. Are you so? Oh, your path. Okay, well, if you're first, you will be able to get increased attack. So, let's do that. What is this? Apply and hit blind. If we miss, we give them crit. Not great, but... Uh, I think we're going to do that. Because I'm getting rid of this stupid thing, man. No, I ain't doing that. Get, get that garbage out of my face. Um, extra flame resistance and this. Uh, sure. Um, I don't really want to mess with... I mean, maybe extra healing receives, but... That's good enough. And we ride. Good load. We're going to break our armor, which is incredible because we've already broken one once. I will say RNG hasn't been favorable so far. But this is the first area. And we got to do three more of these before the mountain. So surely one of these is going to pop off for us. You know, we just had to start off weak so that when we build up, it's cooler. Oh, a hero shrine. That's fun. Let's do man at arms again. Do his next ability is. Chapter two. A leader of men. Okay, so this one's a battle, and you want to know what's cool? You can lose these. And that's it. You have to find another hero shrine and do it again. You don't get an ability. Marching his men to victory. It's happened. I want to talk about it. All right. What are we doing? So we have to kind of figure out. It's usually like a puzzle. But right now, this one's pretty easy. Everyone's faster. Okay, but they're all weak and dazed. What's happening? Was it my speech? Was it a bad speech? Okay, well, you guys aren't... Guys? You're... You guys want... One damage. Yo, these enemy soldiers are kind of way nicer with it. How do we get th those? Two damage. Huge, huge, huge. This guy's going to do one damage. Two damage. Oh, my God. We've almost won. All right. I have more now. Uh, I can put somebody forward. And they'll do more attack. I can bring somebody back and protect them. You know what? Who's going first? You are? Forward! You're already in the front. Wait, what? Conflicting orders. Wait, what? I'm already failing the puzzle, apparently. Okay. I'm assuming I have to figure this puzzle out before all my comrades die and I get fully stressed. Which is not going well, I have to admit. 
Advance? Flank? Bro, I... This speed thing doesn't help. Get... Get... Get in there? Maybe you'll get in there? No, you... I thought maybe that time it would work. It didn't. And we, can we focus, like, one of the same so we can at least... Oh, my... We're gonna fail this one, aren't we? I swear, me mom. Why'd they keep critting, bro? Oh my word. Please. My brother in Christ. What is this? What do I do? I don't know. Amen. Did I fail? Oh, okay, I did. All right, never mind. I guess that's we just had to complete take out. Total failure of command. A great debut there, buddy. And fast. Oh, that's pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good. You know, I'll even turn. Deserted by my own cunning. Yeah, what's she doing? Um. Well, I guess I don't really need to do this because I have the gesture to reduce stress. Well, that's not true. Actually, right now, everybody's stressed. I should probably use that. Um, let's just do it. All right, and now for the final fight. Oh, and we get a route encounter too. So two more fights until we hit the end. Now, you do passively regen some health while you're out and about on your wagon. Depending on the flame and stuff and other things is how much you recover. Humanity. But yeah, like once you exit, uh, a, as you see, a combat, your health is the same, your stress is the same. Pretty much the only time you really get to fix any of that, if you can, is the end. We got to de-stress everybody. So let's start with you. <laughs> Now you're just gonna a crit. Oh, you're nuts. This guy's gonna go invisible. The coward. He's gonna crit next turn. Um, I'm going to advance. Kill you. Then I'll Omega Death Blow you or whatever next turn. Confers advantage. I'll reduce your strength. Oh. Right, we're friends. Part the toy bleed. Not great, but that's okay. You have increased attack. My man. Let's combo him. Big combo. Love to see that. I love that. Good. Knock you back, but that doesn't really do much for me. I think I'm going to stand fast. Now, I think this should kill this, as long as I hit six damage. Nice. So normally he's shrouded and I wouldn't have, or invisible and I wouldn't be able to target him, but because it's not a single target, that whole thing, we're good. Anyhow. Kaboosh! Oh, and I knock him back because of that. Okay. He missed, stupid! Oh my god, this is free. This is so free! Alright, he's on death's door, so now we just need one good hit. Bah! Easy. Go next. We go again. Victory! Extra crit chance. Less healing received from skills. I mean, uh, it's not bad. Wouldn't mind if you crit a little more. Or maybe even our jester. Right? Get rid of the fire resistance. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, that's an N item. That's Okay. Now we gotta fight some cosmic dudes. So at the end of every map, there's always a cosmic encounter or whatever. I'll show you what that is. Ooh, right now. Oblivion's Rampart. So they do be some celestial cosmic beings. 
We hate him. This guy buffs nonstop. This guy can also debuffs. This guy does like um, damage over time and AOE. This buffs, dodges, blah, 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 blah. I am going to hit you all with this, which could potentially bleed you all. Weaken them. That another and that went pretty well, actually. Okay. I could reduce stress, but I kind of want to start off on the right foot. Please tell me we make him bleed. Hog. We're going to double up here. A crate on the... Oh, my God. Insane. Um, I can kill the baby. The cherub. Wait, 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 he's not dead. He'll bleed. He'll bleed. All right, unless he heals. Don't you dare heal. He buffs everybody. Don't you dare heal. Okay, All right, he did. Gave him a different boss. Stupid. You should have healed him. And you're bleeding. And you're stressed. And here's the AoE. With the double? What the fuck? Ain't no way. We gotta start whacking this dude. Alright, it's alright. We're fine. We're fine. I feel fine. Um... Five to eleven damage. There's a world where we have mega high roll. Alright, we're not living in that world, but it would have been cool. Um Alright, if I don't kill it here, it's gonna get a turn. I don't want it to, so. Now the occultist will kill that, so then it's just down to this boner in the front. You got a boner in the front and a boner in the back. Uh What do I want to do? I'll protect you. I'm your protector. I won't let you die. Ba -da -da -ba -ba. Stupid freaking boss. <laughs> An eight crit even through all that. Oh, you're nuts. We... What are we doing here? Instead, we'll heal. A crit heal. Oh. Slow suffering begins. Oh, on then. Now we point blank freaking gun. Didn't have that increased armor, I tell you what. <laughs> Gonna get one more attack, which is annoying. But the repost might do it. Mm, that's the I know everybody's a little stressed out right now, guys, but it's gonna be okay. Oh. Alright. First area down. Freaking easy. Just a lot more to go. Okay. Stain item is equipped extra damage, 50%, less max HP. Now hold on a minute. Now wait a minute. Now see, this boy's gonna make me act up. Or even this dude, actually. Yeah, I'm gonna do this dude. Because his freaking, what is this thing? It's doing tons of damage. So he could be doing 6 to 14 every turn or something? Heck yeah, bro. I'm here for it. And the other one is, what is this? Bleed resistance. What do you currently have? Healing given. Okay. We'll take it. Uh, so if you're curious, like the stained items, it's like boss things. So you have to essentially, like what it says... Use one stain trinket to allow you to use another. But we made it to the end. Oh, I'm popping off. Hogging out of my mind, dude. We got the trophy to throw on here. There are yet places. Alright, so this. Where a little what life the fuck? still gathers. Is this This isn't right now, is it? No way you all just gained eight bajillion quirks. I don't think so. We got the trinket, though. Wow. No, you guys did. What the fuck? You got sneaky. Extra speed. Can't get enough of the hard stuff. Bro. I'm at start. 25% chance to be invisible. 
I don't want you to be invisible, bro. Oh my god. First cadaver, extra crit. Resistance piercing. Shroud scrounger. Void sight. Oblivion tear route scouting. Book burn. No stone left unturned. Unless bleeding resistance. Interesting. First off, let's throw on our trophy. And here, um, gives us better scouting possibilities. Mastery training, we have four. We get upgrade. Upgrading this gives us enhanced defense for a whole bunch. Like that. What about this dude? What are we using on this dude? We could remove or make them weak twice and remove a crit thing. Getting this heal, a better heal. He's all about getting these fist things. Which only works when they're comboed. It will work with over here. We better repost or point blank shot. Hasn't really been pairing it out for us, I'll be honest with you. But if we're going to pump damage with you, screw it. There. Use that a whole bunch. Um, which means... Ooh, that's pretty good. Oh, oh that's minus five speed for three turns? Oh, wait. Screw it. Let's do that, and then I'll equip it. And for you, this will stun if they are comboed. That's pretty good. Now let me switch your abilities before I forget. All righty then. We already have a couple end items. This one gives us a chance to just get dodge uh, until next end. 21 health. Oof. All that for the extra damage. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, no, I forgot. No, you have... It's just if you're first in the turn. And this one is to... Crit chance. Give you an extra crit chance. Give you dodge. Let's just see what our next rat's going to be. So we have the Shroud, the Fotor, and the Sluis. Or... How do you say that? Let me double check who has what. So you have Shroud and Photor. Okay. Probably Photor then. For this. Avoid the Watchtower. We get some candles. Flesh Scouting Chain. Oh. The Sluis, I don't actually entirely know what this is about. Yeah, I, ju I just don't. So you know what? Hey, let's do it then. Eh? Throw it. A risky proposition. I do need to give us armor back. The roads are rife with peril. Don't want to be going around without our armor. Let's see. Answer scout. Eh. Eh. Check out in items here, huh? So. Very possible to increase relationship. Extra health. Let's buy that. Um, reduces stress and gains up to a yo. Hold on, let me use this. Let me see for myself, huh? Get, get out of this menu. Okay, first off, extra HP, you. And then you, because you have less. Now let's reduce your stress. And you gained one relationship. Okay. Spend what I think you I'll buy can. another one. Should I spend all my gold? Mm, I don't know. If indeed it ever did. But I'm probably going to. Two targets. Minus four stress. I don't know if we might be overcome. Okay. 
Let's just do this again. Plus two. And then this one. What is this? Two targets. So because of his... Um, one of his perks. Or quirks. Negative quirks. He can't take this. So instead I'll give it to... Actually, I'm going to do you guys... What? Oh, I thought you guys liked each... Wait. I thought that was going to... Get bamboozled. What the fuck just happened? I wanted to get their thing up so there'd be a greater chance that they would form a relationship. But... Anyway, well, that's not happening. Combat items. There's anything want here. Ah, y'all. All right. You guys are... You're fine. Walk it off. All right, don't be so dramatic. Oh! Oh, no shot! Eyes, muttered threats. Please. <laughs> so, yeah, so those are the negative relationships. Which is incredible, because what are the... First off, that's great, because this is what we like to use every turn, and it... Oh my god, it increases stress? Like this one... It makes the other one get taunt and vulnerable. Now the enemy's gonna hit him and do more... Like I said! RNG, baby! Yeah. What the fuck? What are their relationships? What? Tread carefully and quick. For them to this for them to get a negative relationship country. with that is incredible. Because that's not very high. Oh my god. And if I'm not mistaken, we have to take the debuff perk. We can't not. Oh yeah. Dumb. <sighs> yeah, wait, wait. All right, but yeah, um, there's not even a map in this place. Oh, there is. No, there's not a map. Never mind. Yeah, I like. Um, let's go left. I still don't. I don't know that much about this place, but loathing. Okay, great. Lo we love that. Love that. We found some um, rancid-looking food. Oh. Oh wait, this is good. This is good. No, this is wait. You want to leave? No. We're gonna grab this because we get a combat item and a quirk. However, it could be bad. But yo, well, and you guys already hate each other. Minus two. Oh my god, and it's a negative quirk! <gasps> like I said, you know, when it rains, it pours. I'm fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. What does this do? And I make somebody actually that's really good. What the fuck? Make someone blighted and burned for a lot of damage for three turns. Nothing was worth all that. Freaking. We went left last time, so now we go right, of course. I do you hear some piggies? This is a fight? Yes. Combat. Let me at him. Disgusting. What the fuck is this? Measure out your violence. What does this do? Judiciously. judiciously. Swine brute. That's a big boy. I like the music. Bam. About this. Some pretty good damage. Hey, that's pretty good. I'm going to rush forward. And get ready to repost. We missed, but that's okay. I'm gonna use this. Oh, it only hurts him because he takes up two spots. Uh, actually, I'll hit you because then. Oh, sheesh. Killed him too. But yeah, I get the little fish thing. Um, I killed him early because I know from fighting those worm things. We can rely if you kill something else first and then the worm goes, they consume the corpse and literally 
mutate into a bigger, harder to kill worm. So, didn't really feel like uh, messing with that. You know, call me crazy. Now I could slow them all down. Where do you hit? Analysis you could hit the back. The you like to action. hit. It's just the front. Uh, so I'll just give you and I some armor here. Yep. He missed. Stupid. Couldn't be us. And now I can't target him. So I go forward. Mine damage is pretty good. Wait, what? Oh, I can't do that because he's... Actually, making bear stand taunt is good. Having him be vulnerable isn't. What are they? Nothing else. And again, I don't really. I. Mm. Oh, I can. I can pull him. Sure. It also clears corpses. So he resisted it, but because I cleared the corpse. Gives me a chance to actually do something. Uh, this is terrible for everybody. So instead, bellow. Nice hit, stupid. He still has an invisible. Good crit, though. Good damage. We love that. We love that. Still can't hit him. Is the key. So, I guess just bolster again. And. Okay, well, you can hit now. Okay. Alright. Okay. And. Freaking. Noise! And I had two fists. Seven crit. What the? <laughs> One more hit. What is his death resistance? Death resistance. 5% and we didn't, of course. But I'm ahead him with a gabagoo. <laughs> That's a crit. So press your advance. Nice. That was only a roadside, though. We took... Well, we, but... Highwayman took a decent amount of damage, but... Maybe we'll make that up on the road. Oh, what is this? Oh. Something I unlocked for the jester. I've never seen it before. It's a it's a trinket for him. Um, if the target is bleeding, extra damage. Life soft skills, extra damage dealt. I also receive extra bleeds, but okay, okay. I like that. Right. Now what? So what is this slice soft skill? Extra damage. Dealt. Harvest, also count. And I guess I should. Nothing else. Bleed. All right, that was pretty lucky. Now I know what's next. I don't know how long this thing is. I don't know. I've only ever done this like once because there's no map. That looks like a creature then. Not the war. I don't know what this is. Oh boy. Board. Wants to run. Get increased. No. Boner. Whatever. You guys already hate each other. You know, whatever. Which doesn't make any sense to me because, like, the odds of that happening with the relationship you had is so low. I've never seen that dude. Yeah, I've never Let's seen take a Swine Skyver. I as repulsive as it is. Um. Okay. So, if they're bleeding, I do extra damage. And I should apply more. That's what I have been told. Uh, you know, I'm actually going to go with this. Because I get rid of two dodges. Maybe I bleed them. I can do this for the damage and hopefully get through the dodges. He hit one. He's stressed, but whatever. I'm going to advance. Okay. And then, I fell on. 
Yeah, why not? They're all pretty slow, but... There's no debuffs. Why are you all attacking my jester? And why are you critting him and moving him and stressing him? Stupid. All right, now wait a minute. He, he just spit roast me? What the? Hold on. My dude bled, took a dick and a damage, stressed, and stunned. He doesn't have an action? What the fuck just happened? What? Well, I don't like this. This could kill, and it does. A promising development. This could kill, and it does. One less obstacle in our path. You're stunned. That sucks. And then I will. Act you. Hopefully they don't hit you. Of course, all right. No, nope, just and blighted. Amber, what the? Why are you going for him, bro? Oh, okay. How much damage are we taking? Everyone's taking like five damage. Good load. Uh, all right, we got a heal for getting someone. I am guaranteed to crit here. So. Uh, who do I go for? Go for you. Oh, impeccably timed. There we, we advance. How much health? Six. Two, two. Cooperation is the key. I don't want to have to do this, but I heal. Bleed will kill you. And this dude surely goes for him. Of course he does. We are getting high in the old stress meters, Chief. In crisis, no gain is Need to mitigate that. <laughs> Next fight, hopefully. The loathing abates. The loathing abates. I don't know where to go. Oh, right. Righty time. It's the old left, right, right. Oh, wait a second. Is that a combat item? An in item. What is a combat item? Remove something. The loathing. Again. How, wh what is my luck, bro? The, now, one of the things we did does remove loathing. So, wait a minute. There are rumors these Whoa. rigorous beasts have some. Oh, just another one? He wants to just leave? I like that. I like that plan. Okay, maybe it's literally just like each route is 50-50, good or bad. It's like an award, a reward, or fight. I mean, we haven't picked fast yet. Oh, am I missing something? Oh, what? I didn't shit. Oh, okay, that's and imbue them with purpose. The uh, random ally on turn start, add a positive token. That's for the thing, that's for the in some combat items that room. Okay, okay, I mean, we take those, we most certainly take free stuff. I still don't know. I know we, we we actually haven't been able to use that. This adds blind. I like that. And then oh, I've also had this. Get you some death resistance and rest resistance. Random ally on turn stuff. I don't know if that's what I want to give you, though. And you're kind of vibing. Oh, when stress damaged. Okay, well, first up, I just gave you stress resistance. Then you have it. Okay, stress damage, heal. There you have it. 
And we continue. Bada bottom. There go the wheels. Why is everybody getting mad at each other? Can't we be friends? And we gotta fight again? Anybody wanna run? Any runners? Yeah, but everybody hates that. Oh. <sighs> Alright, fine. Minus. Oh. RNG, feel free to. Wait. Okay, wait. They have buffs. They're all stun resistant. Okay, well. I don't really have any stuns, so jokes on you. We need to kill that dude. Let me honest with you. His um, hit, stun, move thing? Not a big fan. Oh my word! Just 16 to 2. What the fudge? That's insane. It's quite literally insane. Right, I'm going to reduce your stress and my stress. Oh, we like that. Oh, wait, he's going to consume. Oh, forgot about that. Eh, it's all right. We'll take care of him. It was worth the double kill. Oh, also, how was I supposed to know? Let's see. Now, rampant mutation. And I think they can mutate once more after that, but I don't know. <laughs> Um, do I want to reduce stress or do I just want to whack? I feel like whack's probably the play. Um, but then again, now I want to get I want to get the stress under, under lockdown or whatever. Please hit through the dodge. Um, oh, he's gonna go invisible. You, Can't like do anything. Hmm. Well, I can put your attack down and combo you. Cooperation is the key. Um. Who does it like Let's to attack? Pretty much people in the front. As repulsive as it is. I'll help you out, buddy. I'll be there for you. You do it, and of course you went for you. Bloody thumb, and you bleed. Oh, what the fudge? You're invisible, I actually can't do anything about you, so freaking kaboosh. Oh, this means he can melee now. So that's more. And then. We could Omega High Roll. Nope. Oh, but we did stun him, even with his resistance. But then I can't hit him. Okay, but that's the one. Okay, so you're telling me there's a chance. I'll reduce your stress. Fear not, my friend. Now you're gonna die from your bleed, hog, and you're gonna do. Buff damage? What the fuck? That's not what I had in mind. In crisis. We can rely I can't. only upon each other. Can't hit this dude. And I don't want to move forward because I won't be able to. Whatever. Okay, well now I should be able to. If I can't hit him, what else can I? Okay, now I can hit him because there's no other option. Good crate. Good crate. We love to see that. Uh, debuff. We'll die to burn anyway. So, just... Yeah! I didn't want to stress anybody out. With his primary attack. We are the flame. Right. Burning brightly for all the world to see. That one didn't go terribly. Hero goal complete. Oh, wow. What, what was your... I didn't even look at your hero. It was... Land the killing blown creatures. Oh. Land the killing blown cadavers. I don't even know if we found one first off. Eight of them? What the fuck? Land the kill and blow on a lair boss. Ah. Could have actually done that one. Visit away, so we haven't even found one. So those are just optional things that you can complete during a run. And obviously, like you saw, if so, you gain just a couple extra candles, which is, again, the currency for the meta progression. 
So it's not at all necessary, nor will it like help your run. Currently, it's just help you unlock stuff. Oh, we made it! Wow! Alright. Maybe shorter. Maybe this shorter. Welcome in! <laughs> A lot of stress reduction, the rest of the and soul. you got, ooh, good, good. Oh, I love Jinx. Just apply like tons of debuffs possibly every time you tank somebody. Big fan. Wainwright, I have this chance to produce traps. A new variable in the equation of your fate. Sure. Master trainer, how much? Do Listen, practice, improve. How did we get zero? What? Conventional what is this fair, about? But fairly priced. Conventional fair, but fairly priced. Random hero after each location. Minus one stress. We're a full though. I'm keep I'm trying to keep baubles because if we ever find a hoarder for 65, you can get the trinkets that are like made for specific people. Those are all pretty good. What do we have here? I need anything that will increase party relationships. That is Omega Gamba. How about this? Sort of also really Omega Gamba. That's some good food, though. Let's try this out. Who targets? All right, who has the worst relationships? Oh my god you hate everyone dude what's your problem you and you okay thank god you lots of extra hp when i give somebody else there you uh there's a chance you get disease but i believe oh. and possibly ability to dodge okay now let's see if i can get a couple more Relationship things. Something to so gamba, but we got you and you. Plus six. Holy crap! Never did. I didn't even know it was possible. That's incredible. Well, sheesh. I think I I am pushing my luck. Then I'll get a wheel back. We head out. The Fotor or the Sprawl? What's this? Clear out the lair. Ugh. Keep the flame at 40 plus. Like the Sprawl. Didn't we already do the Sprawl? Right? Isn't that crazy? I've never seen it. I've never seen one come back. I want to do this for the mastery point, but we'd have to clear out the lair. I don't want to fight the lair again. Like, we did that. The farms and <coughs> Screw it. We probably won't get the mastery point, but... Overrun with putrescence and rot. I'm begging you, bro. Bro, I'm begging you. Yeah! We're hopeful. The hopeful. Ah, and we're hopeful. Okay. What does this do? We give each other less stress and less stress. Uh, yeah. See? Our luck's turning around. Birds flying high. You know how I feel. Sun in the sky. You don't know how I feel. What the? What is good? So many things. Destiny Where do you guys want to go? Oasis? We haven't got one of those yet. Creature Den. That leads to we don't know. There's the lair. Cash. Ooh, the hoarder. I don't want to go to the hoarder. Uh, let's go Oasis. Because on the rare chance we find one more. We would complete that quest. Like two candles. Love me some of them candles. 
Literally, boom, boom. I should also note, by the way, you don't have to push your luck. Whenever you're at an inn, you can end your run. If you're a little sh sissy baby. <laughs> what do I look? Gamba! Push out. What did you mean? Now, the reason you would do that is because you would uh, get more candles. If you die outside, you still get candles, but you wouldn't get as much as either obviously completing the entire run which you get a bunch or at an end um uh, just something there something to keep in mind what is this thing a distraction this no what is it extra flame and few supplies a freaking yeah dude what do you mean you don't want some minus two just when you guys are starting to get along but whatever minus three and a heal and you didn't want that? Bruh. What's wrong with you? What? Ah, yes. Um. Uh... <coughs> How about going down? You want to damn. Right, we're gonna lose some armor. Whatever. We would lose another armor if we end up going to the camp. Which would lead to, I don't know, and then a lot of wheels, but the hoarder. We could go lair that hoarder. Another cache. Someone needs our assistance. Um, we get flame and wheels back. Flame and food. Oh my word. Lose relics, but flame, food, and food. But these guys like each other if we do this. Mm. Double the food, though. I mean, we don't need the flame. Nah, let's do this. Double food. Double. Yeah. That comes out to be like 20 gold, so it's really not that you guys both want to go to the way. Really. Funny thing about that, isn't it? We have no reason to go there, my dudes. We already have the trophy. Yeah, if we beat the boss, we'd get just some other cool things, but... Also, really likely we'll just, you know, die. So... Stress out a little bit. I don't care. We're not getting the mastery point. Whatever. Call me a coward if you will. You always were a coward, Mickey. You always were. Oh, but see, he's happy or something. Because he's happy to clap along if you feel like a... Person in the darkest dungeon without any hope. Oh, I don't know. Free stuff. Don't mind if I do. Light resistance. Food thing for the thing. And items. Combat items. Heck yeah, bro. Oh yeah. Your coach is Wait, this is actually pretty big. You can carry no more. Is it? This roots people. But the big thing is it reduces their bleed resistance. And since we got that thing on him, there's a better chance. And inflicting more blade. Now we are over encumbered. Oh. No, we're not using that. We're not using that. For that. For that. Alright. Or. I mean, I kind of like that. I don't actually. I feel like I should get rid of something. I don't know. The lost souls of a dying yeah. world. Empty of hope. Oh, hello, fella. This dude's like an elite, so he's going to have more HP and whatnot. Not cool. What exactly does it give him? 40% extra max HP. Apply burn on hit faster. 40% more damage. 10% extra chance. What the? That dude's got to, uh, mm, how do I say this? Die. 
Oh, this blinds him too? Okay, last. Eight crit? Sheesh. Um, We just all focus this dude? Sure. He's going to try and hit us, but he's blinded. Now we could pull him. Or just do... He does have armor. Oh, I could get the uh, fist thing. Same thing. Yeah, why not? Uh, do we want to slow them? They're already pretty slow. No. Gaboosh! Now I gotta be careful. This dude kind of like fell the tree or whatever. That actually, literally, yeah, fell the tree. Is no time All damage alter. without critting. Hurts. But go for it. Great stuff. Mm. Oh, it was a low roll, but all right. Stunned you. Hold on. Now I'm gonna hit him with the gobble the ghoul. He gets knocked back. Then who should I? I think I will protect you. I'm not sure that works with repost though. Okay, they want to hit him. The repost doesn't act. Anymore. I forgive you. Now, if I made any of these bleed, I would actually do more damage. But I'm not doing that. Well, he keeps resisting. Oh, we dodged. Nice. Oh, I forgot he's stunned. I was letting you do most of the damage. Well, this should stun him. He resisted. All right, take that back, of course. All right, but he's, he's, well, dead, but he'll be on death's door. Unless this dude protects him. Empowered. Literally, Emboldened. can't get to him now. Fine, it's fine, because he just does uh, get down Mr. President. There's more damn. Actually, I'm trying to crit him. And it's a crit. I meant stun. Did I say crit? I meant stun. We stunned him, so. Um, he still protects during a stun, though. I was kind of hoping he. Now hold up. Oh, no! He horrid. A 50% chance at the start of our turn to take stress damage. Which uh, isn't great. Now the burn's going to kill this dude. Bet. All problems have their solutions. It's just that easy, folks. That's door. Yes, sir. I'm going to hit him with the gob of the ghoul. So far, so good. I don't want to, you know, get ahead of ourselves, One but in the extreme. things are going okay. And I'm again full on this stuff. Get rid of that. And then. All that. Uh -huh. We must understand the past. Okay. Never to be free of it. Do another hero thing. We can keep going man at arms. Get a cultist. I, I sort of feel like this finishing ones thing is kind of the play. I don't know, just like it, it, it feels better like checking them off rather than like a little here, a little there. It's kind of like when I eat. That's my wife. There's like different things on my plate 
the men of his regiment would interrupt his fitful convalescence. Mutilated and maimed, the spectral garrison clawed at his bed covers, whispering hateful truths in his ears. The exhausted attendants in the field hospital would wake to the sound of panicked screaming and inglorious sobs. It was not the war that had taken his eye. It was pride. Two food. Uh, I can only eat like one thing at a time. I don't I can't mix. I eat one thing, finish it, then move on to the next dish. Cool down one. Um repost and taunt. Ooh. Ooh, I like that. I like that. The loathing howls. The loathing increases again. Ain't no way we're gonna do it again, right? Pretty good. Um, I haven't used knockback yet. But it doesn't matter. Retribution. Holster skill. Uh, I see, I see, I see. <coughs> We're not using it for now. Stress is okay. And we have uh, the gesture to play a lovely tune to remove a lie if we get them. No chance it's another armor. Oh, still hungry. oh that's the wheel. Oh, okay. I thought it was armor. It's a good thing we avoided that, huh? That's the cosmic people. No, thank you. The hoarder we're popping off. All right. Now, so this is for the highwayman. Extra damage for positive token. Highway robbery skill gives me two repost. If relics in inventory are greater than 100, minus 15 credit. Well, not even close. This is for anyone. Man at arms. When hit, possible chance to get defense. Apply an attack. Fellow skills. 10% chance to stun. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. You only do that. And then, you know, it's like I'm not using that. Do we want any of this stuff? Eh, yeah, maybe not. That'll do, Chief. Thank you. All right. You get a cool little trinket now. I'll take that. So, bellow skills. So, this now also has a chance to stun. That's pretty insane. And you get good defense. And you're never going to be turn start because you are so slow. So, we are vibing. No, we're not. Are you? Ain't no way. I've never had the loathing increase. The loathing consumes. 20% So is it at like 30% extra max HP or something? Or is that cumulative? Of course, the one time I got close to beating it, it never had increased HP. So. Looking forward to that. It's fun. Restuff them. All right. Purpose. Gonna have to figure out what to get rid of again. Uh, I just don't think we. I mean, I can hold off on the chance. No, oh, but ah, uh, this blind ain't it. No, I'm just getting rid of it. Not happen. We don't need that. Don't need that. Those end items are real nice. We're gonna keep those. Uh, about that. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Where are we going? Uh, lots of fights in the loading. There's a healer. I don't really need. I guess I get rid of some negative quirks. That hurts our armor. That increases loading. Actually, that'll be armor anyway. All right, fine. We'll go to the right. I at least know what I'm getting myself into. 
the flame also do be looking pretty small. So go ahead. Like I don't, I haven't been using. Wow. They'll be able to increase the flame in battle for us. All right, we have no armor though, so we cannot take these routes. Because if you don't have them and you hit them, you get jumped. And it's terrible because one person on your team always has to like repair. It's, it almost feels like a wipe every time. All right, we lose flame but get in items. Lose flame but get stage coach. Just a lot of flame. Oh. That's good. Don't even really have to do it. I didn't want to reduce our flame even more. Now, granted, two in items would have been nice, but. But whatever. To heal, you have chosen wisely. Now I just need to figure out. Insane. Um. There's a negative corks we might want to get rid of. I feel like we don't have any super bad one. I say that. But... Field hospital. No one needs healing. Works. Um. Like, none of these feel terrible. But I do just have some extra coin. Kind of like this. Even the worst habits can be overcome. This. And this. Just so I think all that blocks in items. So now next time, you know, everyone should be able to interact with everything, if need be. I don't know. Won't even really be able to buy in items now, but yeah, on second thought, maybe no regrets. Decent enemy, so they do be speedy. Yep. Alternate lock. Oh, bleeding already. Okay. I'm gonna go for the double bleed. A war combo and burning and on what the and crit okay wait 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 wait, wait. time out what the fudge is going on crit again. bro this dude's taking eight wait, 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 where'd the stress come from what just happened what the fuck ain't no way I'm blinded too. Well, at least I hit. Jeebus. I don't like these dudes up. You got one. A promising development. Um. I think I taunt myself. Yeah. I don't want to. How are you? Oh, I thought you were hitting them. I was like, how? No, it's just my turn. Um. You do have increased attack. But I feel like I should... Yeah, I should reduce his stress. Get reposted. You don't do a lot of damage, but... Thought that counts. And Gabbadagool. The double repo... Oh, we didn't both repose. He was taking 10 damage at the start of his turn, and he got hit. Oh, word. Or oh, lord. I got a healing four health of trust. Brother, he's still on death stool. Okay, all right, all right. You get less stress. You heal for three. Admittedly, yet yeah, probably better on paper. But... Two health. What the fuck? Nice protecting him. A good guard dollar. Oh, We're on death door here. Variable. Ah! Easily resolved. Um, yeah, I'm gonna pass to get HP back. I ain't going to risk it. Thing. Like I'm just, just kill you. Oh wait, but the dog's gone. How about this? Oh, this removes your attribution thing too. Wait, no, it missed. But the stun hit? How in the world does that work? Incremental. Stupid. But deadly all the same. Um. 
Well, I can try and heal you again, buddy. But I might also bleed you again. Now you're fine. Nine health. That's worth it. Don't attack my guy. Okay. Eight. What are you doing over there? Oh, you're right. You're stunned. Hog. Uh. You're dead. Oh, Poggin. They don't have to start, so they're not going to take up a jillion damage from there. Bust. Messy. That was... Was that a side encounter? I don't remember. An unexpected find. It was, I think. A roadside encounter? Yeah, that like first turn or whatever. That's freaking... <laughs> Alright, well, it's Oblivion Rest or whatever the pitch. Wait, wait. Oh, I meant to... Hold up, hold up. We're not going to need a flame here. Let's, what is this? Bleed resistance. And these. Mm. And then you hold that. All right. Got this. We win these. I've seen us win these. We get a little a double action here. Now, the bleed resist practically nothing. Did I use it here? Nah. I should bleed them both anyway. Well, got the big one. We want me. 13 damage. Bro, it's kicked up back there. Unfortunately, we didn't stop him from getting turn off. That would have been pretty insane. Uh, worship. He does like an Omega move next turn. Oh, all the more reason to just make sure he doesn't. What's your stun? Hey, we have a pretty good chance of stunning. Let's try it. Oh, <laughs> huge actually. Now, if you double debuff him, we'll bone. Um,. You know what? I'll just take him out. Good stuff. Let us hope to and you're stunned. Oh my god, it's that easy. That hurts, but... Alright, but I do extra damage to people on... Yeah, look at that. to 15. With a crit 22! Oh my word! My dude's popping off. Kill you in the back. Ow! I don't think I've ever had this clean of a cosmic fight. And do not relent. Okay, well, well, I take it back. He will have death, whatever. But he does have some debuffs, so there's a chance they just kill him. And if only every fight went like that. What the fuck? The roadside encounters are in that. Sweet reprieve. What? Until the next test is put <sighs> in you. Oh, no. If Stain Diamond is equipped, 75% max HP, less damage. I thought it was damage. 75% damage. And... Are these good, though? But the only person I'd really want to put that on is Man-at-Arms, and he has his thing. Nah, I don't think so, but thank you. The loathing whispers. I mean... I'll hold on to it, just. But I find it highly unlikely we're going to use that. Loathing Whispers. It's a good game, man. I know a lot of people like Darkest Dungeon 1. Aren't like huge fans of this one because it's a little different. But see, Darkest Dungeon 1 never really caught me. Got my attention, but I love DD2. Rest tonight. Under the mountain's unblinking gaze. Regions to mountain. Wait. The mountain isn't next, is it? No, no. One more and then the mountain. Okay, so we finally got some mastery, though. So that's something. Now, retribution. Also give us block. Pretty good. Um, three reposes. Oh, I also don't have to... 
is a relationship thing. Um, maybe do this. We're liking the bleed potential. I could re remove more. Um, you know, killing blows. a better heal just a safe big play and i think he i think he needs something i think if i do retribution i should be doing stand fast too yes yeah, grip so the plan here i'm just gonna get rid of like the knife is essentially like Retribution, stand fast, retribution, and I keep getting armor, I'm taunting, I repost, and I can debuff. I like that. Oh, this gives us a little extra crit chance. Thanks. Right, we already have some in items. This is mega good for you. I'll give it to you since you got. And you both take that. They can only eat one food buff, though, so that was their food. Um, They could really like each other, or they could hate each other. Naturally, it doesn't go. This dude's likely to taunt? Oh, heck yeah. What does the provisioner have? Precious relics remind us Can't of buy the time that much. before the end. Hmm... Just hold. Do I gamble with this? What's everybody's relationship? Not what? Wow! I thought it was going well. Why are we so in the negative again? God. Okay. I'm gonna buy these and try and salvage what I can. All right. So who's pissed at who? This dude's like pissed at everybody. So go. You, you, at least it's nine, and then nine. All right, so less likely for something catastrophic to happen. The next stop is Wainwright. Plan accordingly. Uh, get rid of that. Get extra inventory slots. Your I need to fix. Serve you well. This should be just flapjack. Sure. Any advantage is a good yeah, that. thing. And then... Overall, or the sh Is it three plus assistance encounters? That's... There might not even be that many on the map. Yeah, right. Visit an oasis for five candles? I would like the, the mastery points, but... Isolated. I think that's what we go with. Drowning in amphibious degeneracy. Alright. Jester's a little weak. But forget about it. Also, what? <laughs> okay. You guys have a good relationship? Yes, you do. Oh, respectful. I love it. We use this a lot. Gives you attack up and you superior dodge? Um, yeah, I did. Yeah. Don't mind if I'll do it. Feeling good. Last region before the mountain. We keep this up. If we can survive to the end with all four party members, feeling good. The tide. Brind in but, degradation. it's before we see what lies ahead of us, huh? Okay, there's an oasis. That would be the objective. There's a hoarder. I don't know if I'm going to have enough to buy anything. There's the lair. I don't really want to do that. We've got unnet. What's this? All right, buffs. Uh, would like to avoid the loathing. So, so the watchtower would be cute. No thanks. We go here. Assistance. Watchtower resistance. Unknown. And then anything not the lair. Is there ash? Maybe oblivions. Okay, okay. 
So, right first. Unless we wanted... You guys want the creature stone? I mean, that would also work. Creature stone. The cash. We just don't get the watchtower. Who really cares? I can make study into something. All right, fine. Um, yeah, we, we'll be fine. We win these. Ahead, a best ah, God. littered with bones. Of course, the uh, <clears throat> armor is what I fully refilled, not the wheels, and we hit something that destroys our wheels. Whatever. Into the den. All right. You want to go in. You want to go in. You want to leave. We're going in. I'm doing this just because they have a positive relationship. I don't want to mess that up. But you guys are negative seven. That's pretty bad. Because, like, we don't want to go into the boss. Many negatives. What the fudge? Immediately comboed and vulnerable. Man, what is this? Dodge, dodge, lots of dodge. <clears throat> There's two floors here too, and unlike the lair, we don't get a we don't get dip. You know, we're we're here. So, okay, we ended up hitting him. Let me get rid of a dodge, and we bled both. Oh, no. oh I am. Oh, I can't steal the fourth one. I was gonna take that because. Who's superior dodge? Well, that changes things. Instead, I will stun you. Stupid. And then over here, I'm gonna... 16 crit with a 3 burn? Oh, you're one away. You're insane. That's my occultist, dude. Okay, but quit spinning on my dude. Slow suffering begins. Be blind. You're fine. Ooh. Do we want to taunt yet? I think we, we could slow everybody down. But right, the spooters do be a little, a little fast. Nah, I'll just stand fast. And I'll keep buffing myself. You're stunned. Stupid. Now we go ahead of you. LMAO, who's going through? You're going to die to, <clears throat> excuse me. You're going to die to fire. So I'm just going to bop. Finish you off. On to the next. Predator. What can I say? Oh wait a second. Is it isn't doesn't somebody here want to kill creatures? Oh, you already did that. Player boss cavers. Um free bleed. But this dude's gonna go first and mutate. Whatever. Uh, I'm actually gonna go back. So that. Uh, he can melee. Otherwise, I can't hit this dude. He's gonna mutate. Blah blah blah. That's why. Also, I didn't hit him right there because he was gonna heal it with the consumption thing. I think that. All uh, right. Well, he does have two increased the block. So it will chip away at it slowly. You're blind. That's unfortunate. That's okay because we're gonna taunt. Keep everybody else safe. And we'll repost a little bit. Then move forward and combo you. Word. And then oh, I'm gonna stun you. Oh wait, but I can't. Okay, never mind. So I'm gonna move forward. Then you're gonna hit our dude. Who doesn't care? You miss, but that's alright. The bleeding and blight though. I do care about him. I don't like that. Alright, I'm going to debuff you. And then... Man in Arms going to take a little bit of damage. But that's alright. That's alright. It's okay. Doesn't matter anyway. Yeah, I'll just heal. Heal him. Two damage. Oh, man. Look at all this defense. Oh, this is a great combo. I'm a big fan. And then we're gonna point blank. You're at death's door, stupid. Finish it off. Boom! Alright. On to the next one. 
Which does not remove debuffs. I mean, I was kind of... I thought it did. Now, they're just the big... All the big ones. All right. We went through both the dodges. You're nuts. How much damage? Um... Who do we go after first, then? I have thunder. I mean, well, I guess I could go after like this. Mm. Now. Maybe we get a bleed, though? No. Oh, wait, but that doesn't bleed. Spit is okay, because he didn't hit us with vulnerable. We got superior dodge, stupid. Oh, and we're already back to these. Schwaza! Still good, though. Uh, I'm going to take your double defense, LMAO. Thank you. And it gives us a repost. That boy, 12 dot damage. Alright, that's kind of insane. I don't like that. See, I, I increase my defense, but it don't matter if the dot damage just goes through everything. Um... Yeah, it's not what I was hoping for. Ah. I could... Yeah. Hmm, yeah. I wasn't expecting... Uh, uh, did I really need to do that? No. Alright. Let's stun you. Yeah, but 12 crit coup. Love to see it. Hit him with the ha. So this dude's a ragger, bro. You're stunned. You're gonna consume the corpse. Whatever. Sixteen extra. You healed. Okay, well that's not terrible. You are going to crit though, and we do be hurting a little bit. Get rid of an arm. Uh, we will be able to heal you. Although they're moving first. Uh, we might be able to kill here. Death's door, and then bleed might kill. Rage. Nice. Alright, and then don't go after man at arms. Bleh. You want after man at arms? Not cool. Alright, I'm gonna go forward. Then I have to heal you here. 35. Oh. Alright, that's some healing. That's that. That's pretty good. I'm allowed to have a lot of Dang. Uh. Geez, I didn't think we'd make it this far. Then just freaking boosh! You're not doing much damage, but. Come up here. You are fast. I guess I could have reduced your speed. I don't even do that to heal. Right. Oh my. But point point shot. Boosh! With the crit. Mm -hmm. Alright, fine. I'll reduce speed on the off chance. We don't end up wiping me. Although, it's very possible because I can't hit him. Alright, nice. Now we're pogging. Man at arms going to heal off that. Gaboosh! Um, just a wacky. This chaos, this chaos. Alright! That went surprisingly well. And when you do a creature's den, you get an item that if you make it to the end, you get some bonus. So, over to the end, you get uh, all diseases removed and two mastery points. Now that, the mastery points was worth it. Big fan of that. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Bring it around. Okay, we're... Uh, okay, that, that, that one hit the armor. That's fine. We have a medic here. A hospital, but I don't know. We really need anything. Let me double check debuffs.
now I I mean we might fight some fisher folk. So he'll get a little stressed, but I mean aside from that, we're not worried about it. Healing wise, you'll mainly get healed while we're going. Purchasing wise, I can't really purchase anything. Alright. Yeah. Thanks for the help, lady, but I'm good. Can't really afford you. Sheesh. Another armor. Are you and another wheel guaranteed? I ain't no way. Supplies this way, if you can make it. Incredible. Simply incredible, Chief. Alright, well without having the watchtower. Yeah, this I'll suck a little bit. Oh, but we got flapjacks. Is that an end item? Twenty extra health and resistance. Oh, I can't. We got four, and we can give everybody some flapjacks. My oh, but a cash. Would mind some healing items. All right, or none. Work. Your coach is late. Got you. You can carry no more. Uh, blood resistance piercing. Would be good for you. But. I don't know. Having just like guaranteed extra. It's pretty nice. Or 50% damage. I think I'll hold on to that. Um. Well, the flapjacks are just kind of that, but better. We did end up getting four of those. All right, what do you guys want? Because you're probably wrong. Well, not necessarily. If we go this way, the only way our wheels don't get hit. But now granted, it's one fight, two fight. Whereas this would be no fight and possibly no fight. And we don't have to worry about Gamba here. Mm. But again, two fights. At the very least. Also be another. Alright. Is your coat prepared for the upcoming obstruction? This would be worth it though, in the off chance that we end up hitting another wheel. I would much rather take these fights. It is a resistance. Holy crap. Parasite. We actually have three fights. Alright. Well, I take it back. I don't know. This is a lot. What is this? Lots of resistances and everything. Guys are boners. Hit both and bleed both. Nice solid damage. You'll love to see it. Uh, I'm going to go forward. And prepare to point blank. In the meantime, Omega damage to everybody. I, I don't know anyone who does this much AoE damage. I feel like I heard people be like, Occultist kind of sucks. I don't know, bro. I mean, maybe he does. But right now, big fan. Oh, I'm a big fan. Not a big fan of all this burning, though. Seven burning? What the fuck? What in the dickens happened? All right, well, you're dead to bleeding. Almost dead to bleeding. Could I taunt now? I think so, because everybody's getting torched. Literally, they're getting torched. Now we're only going to taunt one, but... That's okay, because we're speedy. Yes, sir. Uh, who's going? You're going? <sighs> Does anybody else? We could take him out. Uh, we have a small chance of killing you. And we hit that small chance. Now, granted, bleed was probably going to kill, but... Freaking burn, brother. All right, but point blank. Kaboosh! <laughs> the other person's going to die to burn anyway. Oh, sheesh, what do I do now? Yeah, you're going to die anyway. I guess... I'll just blow you guys down. Oh, and I stunned? Huge. I mean, it may not matter. Okay, it did matter. But still. Pretty clean. We got through without the burn having to take much tick. But 
having two more fights without really being able to heal in between because we're not going to be traveling that far in the coach wagon stage one. Why can't it's stage coach? Right? I mean, it's a wa wagon. What? What is this? Thing? Oh, right. The resistance and counter. Of the uh, the death can emerge from this. Uh, unfortunately, this is fisher folk. Okay, he he do want to dip. Which I'm not like. I'm not against. We lose money we don't really have. But. The loathing whispers. That's one less fight. I like that. Thank you, Man at Arms and Jester. Right. To see we go again. Enemy ambush. Oh, they all go like ahead of combat start shuffle. Lovely. Love that. Joking all of that. Uh, but I get an immediate point blank. Boosh! 14 damage. Love that. He's knocked back. Stupid. Speaking of which, I need to go back. He's going to protect and then counter. Not sure when he goes. But I can blind him and pinch. He resisted the blind. Never mind everything I said. Rit. Now. Only one bleed. That's fine. Alright, we could kill here. Or hit both of them. I think we hit both of them. Holy Jesus. Well, not when you repost crit 15 put bleed on. What the fuck? Ain't no way. And now I don't have any kills that let me move up. Just taunt back here. All right, well, that wasn't part of the script. What? Oh, the taunt doesn't work because he can't even hit the back line. <laughs> Ain't no way. See, like, the, like if he ends up dying? What? It, no shot, right? Ain't no way. I'm not going to move back. Please bleed. Oh, my God. Yeah. And there it is. Yep. Yeah. Dark. When I said like, yeah, and then sometimes suddenly, hundred to zero, zero to hundred. Just boom, crit, boom, boom, bleed, boom, and no death resistance. By the way, even though we we're supposed to win that coin flip, forty percent chance to kill us. Of course, freaking heads, and of course it's our healer. Oh, nobody else. Can. And just like that, we're going to be lucky to get to the end. Freaking. Please hit. Oh, God. So upset right now. If you're dead, not that it really matters. Ah, oh, protect you. If he'd survived that too, he heals himself and he's like back to full health. And it's fine. Some roadside encounter. You're about to go. Mm, I don't think so. Gaboosh! Alright, the bleed's gonna kill that person. Um. Can't really do anything. I'll just remove your repost and slow the dog. Or maybe I'll get a turn next. Okay, says. Can't even hit the back line. Holy suck. Either can you. It's it's one dog, guys. Can all right, I need to move up so that the dog has to hit me. All right, thank God.
the bleed. Now I'm at the... <sighs> Ain't no way. <laughs> Alright, you gotta wait to heal yourself. You get a little stressed, but... Not nothing else I can do. And... I got a taunt. Low heaven. Just kill him, please! Oh, oh. Messy, but effective. All right, yeah, she and now it's we are just living on a prayer. So we got uh, our hero remains. We bring it back. We get a couple candles, and then the trinkets that were on him. Not good. It, it was looking so good. I was like, man, this is the run. Fucking killing it, bro. Zooming, grooving, moving. Love it. Dead. Extra damage, less health. Can't do that anymore. Well, I mean, we technically could. I don't know. Do we just try and kill things quicker than they can kill us? I mean,. I'm not even close to it. You know what? Why not? I feel desperate. Less that damage, and then maybe I do just need to give you extra HP. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Just get rid of that. I don't know what to do. In items, I mean, I have to even make it back to the end of the first place. Okay, that's a healing combat item. We like that. Put that on you. Give that. We're going to have to start using these. This is a small heal, but it removes stress. This is good combat item. I'm going to have to start using these. this random paper why I ask you why all right well we just can't get unlucky with a rat from here on out let me just see about that where are we headed what was this again? a healer well she understands the this is random but work, also an huge I barely have the baubles I gotta heal you to full. That's all I can afford. Um. All right, we're fine. We're we're fine. At least it wasn't a fight. And I'm gonna have to go cash. Oblivion's ingress. All right. Farmer, are you kidding? Bro, please. If we, now if we run into any armor, we lose the game. Because we'll have three people and one of them has to repair. Ain't no way. I don't even know what you could give me. Thank you, but... Gain on hit. Aunt. Oh. That is very interesting. Now, granted, him resisting this is really good. But if he could just stay taunted, like, indefinitely, I'm going to try it. Screw it. As for this stuff, whatever, get rid of it. Um, get rid of those. What did we just gain? I don't know how to use these. Wouldn't let me. Maybe I have to be in a specific spot. I don't know. Remove blind, whatever. All right, get out of there. Uh, where are you at? I don't know. An elementary problem. All right. Is it not? Oof. 
Having no idea what's waiting for us here. Uh, it's I want to go cash, simply because I know at the very least, how to fight. Who knows what the other way could have been? We would have gotten a candle, but not worth it. I'm just praying. No armor, no wheel thing. You. <laughs> oh my god. What did I tell you guys? You must survive this onslaught. Sure. All right, I think that's it. I think we'll lose here. Uh, so, like, this turn, he's just going to repair. He doesn't do anything. And it makes them vulnerable. Very fun. Very fun. Um, like, it doesn't even... These don't even matter anymore. Whatever. I'll put your speed down. No. Bleed you. Ain't enough. And we have to repair. <laughs> <laughs> Please, Mama. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There's a chance we could have made it if our three characters end up being at least one of our healers. But the healer, like in crisis, we can rely incredible. upon each other. In a throw, you missed. All you missed with all those. I do. Whatever. If he combos us. <sighs> Man, it was going so freaking well. And you got to repair. And then they all go. I'm fine. It's fine. He's vulnerable. Eight damage. Twelve burn. Can we just rewind 30 minutes? We were at the end and everything seemed... Nice. Uh, I gotta heal you, buddy, because the freaking whatever that is about to just absolutely destroy you. We're gonna move how much? Can I? Okay. Sure. Everything hurts over here. I'm just gonna try again. Alright. Okay, and we gotta taunt off. But then I don't really know what to do. Repost, I guess. Alright. Nobody can hit them right now, which is uh sure. Bleed will kill you, thank God. Huge crit. Oh my God. I believe that's not going to finish it. You have to repair. Come on. We, we, there, there might be a way here. Yes. I need. Fit 16 damage from Don. Holy s. He has to, he has to heal. His stress now is through the roof. You have to fix again. That's not what we want. I have to blind you. Oh god. Uh. He's just gonna die again. Repair. <laughs> And now I can't pass to heal anymore. It doesn't work like that. Okay, but I can heal off him. Okay. At least if he hits us. Not death door. He missed. Anyway. Okay. Oh, I'm not gonna die. But. Because the corpse moved. Okay, and he has to repair, which is huge. Might seem bad, but... <sighs> the fuck? Until the next test is put before you. Begging you, bro. Yo, can we get more money and find another healer? That'd be great, man. 
At least it's a cash. And it's loathing, so... Is it ideal? No, but it's not another fight. Not wheels, no armor. What do you got for us? I'll take all and I will figure out what the... Healing given. Yeah, wouldn't that be great? Okay, I don't need all these flashbacks. Would we won't even be able to eat them all for those. Extra speed is nice. Okay. Rid of that. And what's this thing? Shuffle enemy party. The chance to stun. Pretty good. Light, nah. We got that. Oh, stagecoach. Rid of that. Rid of that. Rid of that. Nah. Get rid of all of them. Combat items. Need to give you guys stuff. I'll give you. No, no, no. Give you. Press and heal, and then you get the shuffle. And then you just. What's our flame at? Not good is the answer. Not ideal, but all right. The longer we go without a fight, though, the more we'll pass we heal. But then again, Oblivion's Ingress is next. I don't know if we have to fight it. Hopefully somebody here is an absolute coward. No judgment. I'll be all for it. Flame is going to drain even more. Please tell me we don't got to fight this, bro. Who wants to run? Nobody, <sighs> Nobody wants to run! Why? Why? Now you guys don't want to be cowards! Oh, I can't... It's such a good thing. Go oh, wait, man. In crisis, we can rely All right, I got to use this flame. Um, for both of them. I gotta reduce the stress, but I don't even have time. Wish I could blind, but I don't have time for that. Now watch what you're gonna do. Heal. You little boner. Heal six every turn. Who stress? Honestly? We'll take it. Yeah. Um, I'll reduce some of your stress. You're gonna Savor it. move forward and hit me. I'd like to kill you. Get a crit, why wouldn't you? Don't stress him out, bro. I was working hard on that. Here you guys. Shuffling. Nobody got stunned. Well, that's worth a shot. Okay, you did taunt, so... Boom. Increase your defense. Although they hit both, so I don't really know. <clears throat> and our DPS dude is blind. We gotta use this again. Who's going when? Not gonna be able to stop anybody. You're not bleeding enough. A slow dissection. Disharmony. I don't even know what that does. I think it removed one of my debuffs. Okay, nice. Very respectful of you. Don't you dare heal somebody. I mean, I don't like that either. Heal you again. You're blinded. Come on, bro. I need you. Ah! Oh lord, the meltdowns are coming, bro. The meltdowns are coming, the meltdowns are coming. Right, I'm getting rid of your guys' crits, and I'm slowing you all. Screw it. You also taunt again. You gave him dodge. All things that I'm for. We're going to increase the flame again. I swear you guys are just healing. Like, what is... Uh, 
I just gotta go for a kill, but... Eight to fourteen. Enough. Anyway, we gotta try and get This won't even do it. Could take both your buffs, though. But also... But I can't even kill. Ah. Okay, this might... And stun them? Sure. Okay, we stunned. The bleed might kill before the heal. I don't know how it works. That is sussy. Okay, wait a miss. Stupid. In crisis, All right. We can rely only upon each other. Yours. Uh oh. I think we just go here and heal. You're on death's door. Gotta hope the bleed does the job for us. Okay. The bleed did not work, but you're stunned, so it's fine. This. Okay, kill one dude. Get rid of one block on you. Now, I want to take your bus. All your bus belong to me. Oh wait, don't heal this person. Death throws can still work. And I'm not even going to chance it. Yep. Bleed could have done the job, but if it didn't. Okay, the stress, honestly, that's okay. Did I deal? No, oh, absolutely not. In fact, I think it's time I start the stress in here. Although, I could do some heavy damage. Let's just apply blind, and then I'll try and wait one. Huge. We might even stun. Huge. You can heal. I don't care. You did heal. Okay, I, I lied. I care a little bit, but... Did we heal off that? Or were they not... I thought they were combo. Wait, what is it? I'm gonna be honest. Yeah, I was gonna say, I've never even seen that thing attack. Okay. Amidst the spoils, Alive. An artifact of a highwayman. Oh, hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay. Chance. Okay, what do we got here? Whispers. What do we got here? Melee skills. Extra crit. Extra bleed. Chance to gain... Um, stress on range. Well, no, it isn't that interesting. I haven't been using open bank. Oh, they could. We'd be doing less damage, but I would have more health. And I might heal off stress damage. Honestly. Sure. We, we keep it going, but everyone needs combat items now. We don't need to worry about... Uh, Flame anymore. Add some blinds. And then again, hope we can go for a good stretch. Oh. Oasis. Yeah. And everyone wants the Oasis. Thank God. He's stressing everybody. That boy stressed. I don't need you getting more stress right now. That was good. One heal. That's great, but I need a little more. A little bit more healing from you, buddy. I don't really know what you get from an oasis. Is there one that just heals everyone? Uh, minus stress and th oh heck yeah. Is that for everybody or just him? Honestly, that's okay. We'll take that. The Hero goal complete. Hey, okay, that's extra candles. All right, we lose a wheel, and then this is it. We gotta we gotta fight one more of what we just did. So, in fact, let me make sure we got, like, our best combat up. I like the shuffle. It's not much of a heal, but it's something. Torch you bear. 
but do we just want to like throw in this? Just a whole bunch of things. We'll have some blinds. Yes, yeah, screw it. Wheels is All right. Coach limping. All right. Show me like one more heal before we get there, please. Okay. All right. We got one more. All right. Now the biggest thing I'm worried about right now is stress. A meltdown. Because I just don't really have time to... Oh boy, we got one of them. Huh? Where she's going to go. How do I want to do this? Who? He can Observe pretty much just hit everybody. Alright, I'm just going to hit him with the bouge. He resisted the flames. Okay. I hit both of these, though. Big crit. You're bleeding and you're on fire. Wait, that's freaking huge. That's 11 damage right there. Don't heal him. Not doing damage. Don't make me bleed. Need to talk about this. Um, I can make you bleed more. Crit, how much bleed? And you're burning. That's 10. You're dead. Okay. That's hitting everyone. Honestly, that's okay. He healed off the stress. Um, do I do that or do I taunt? Do I whack somebody? Seem to have some bit of AoE stuff, so I don't know if it matters or not. Let's shuffle you guys. You're in the back. I've never seen that. That's probably good. This gives dodge. Let's do that. Slow everybody. You get superior dodge. And you taunt. Now this. You only hit. Let's see. 10 damage. Yeah, you do die. I can blind you. Blinded. Point blank, but I'll wait. I'm gonna blind you too. Uh, that applies to blind. I didn't realize. Great. Stroke. That dude has tons of debuffs now. How much damage? Oh, but a lot. What does that do? Oh no. Pray, baby Jesus. Come on. Fuck me something. Okay, so that's what happens when you get the max stress. They either melt down or I believe resolution or something. Where they actually pop off and they're like, wait, no, we can survive. And then they like fully heal. A small chance. Could have happened. So instead we melt down. Uh, and subsequently are in a bit of trouble. I can't heal off any of you, so I'm gonna wait. There remains and a pray. foothold out of this mire. <sighs> now right. climb. No worth. No point with these. Okay, you're on death's door. I have to hope that those get you. You remove the stress. Love it. Great. How much bleeding? You're taking 12 damage. Not fun. Just try not to get hit, I guess. You got hit. Oh, the death store didn't work. No. Okay. Oh, more debuffs, but. What is the resistance on this dude? 15. And of course he wins those. All right, all right, all right. All problems have this. their solutions. We can do this. Even the big ones. How did that not put you in the death store? Because now, Collaboration confers advantage. let me see where they can attack. They could choose to hit anyway. All right, well then I have to hit and pray the dot kills him. Oh, Malanta. Oh, we made it. Oh my 
Yeah, we made it. Ooh. Oh, oh, thank the Lord, Lord, baby Jesus. Think about how much easier that would have been with the full party. Crazy, right? Oh. Now, I didn't think we'd make it here. Technically, we could try to move forward. Like, what are you talking about? Well, I think it randomly gives me a new hero now. Of all the ones I've unlocked, which is a whole So, we're going to see what happens. I did get candles, though, for bringing back the remains. So. Hellion. Well, that's not ideal. You get mastery. Now, the reason I say it's not ideal... Well, one, we needed a healer. And two, the big reason we were using the cultist is for the ranged damage. Note, we like no longer have anyone that can hit the fourth slot. Boudica can only hit the fourth slot if she's in the lead. So I would have to go with Highwayman. Doesn't do crazy damage, but combined, maybe enough. Now this trinket becomes useless, but it would have to be Boudica, Beristan, Armenti, Dismas, one or the other, and then they just keep moving. Make sure all your range attack. You only have a, you only have one damaging that hits the fourth slot, and that's that one. And you can be in all, all the last three. You can kind of go wherever. Oh. It's ballsy. That you may stand just a little taller at the, the end. She... Um, six to ten. Um, tempting, tempting. You already upgraded pistol shot for you. Yes, you could do. Take aim. It gives two guaranteed crits. There's some blind and stuff. Highway robbery might not actually help us at all. Double tap. And I don't think I'm going to use duels to paint. Probably not going to use that. That's a matter of things that hit the front. Grape shot. And we might need to upgrade you to reduce more stress. Because like I'm pretty much planning on using you only to do that. Oh, uh, screw it. You might be like, "What is it?" Yes, we're gonna go for it. The next stop is we didn't come this far for nothing. Check our in items. We can only eat one food item, so I don't want to use anything yet. Um, you guys reduce stress and increase your thing by a lot, which is huge. Here you go. Extra speed goes to you. Oh. How fast are you? Fix? You're 10. Take a time. But then your attack would increase. And... Always be hitting the thing. But... Your path alter. Ah. Uh. Rip. Well, I could give it to him and then just hope she wins the 50 50. Or buy an item that gives her even more speed in there. 
Let's see what they're offering. Precious relics remind us of a time before the They're offering up. Okay, well, screw it. I'll do that. Need to check my money. Increase um the whole party can increase speed. Pretty good. I don't want to chance any negative stuff right now. Alright, so increase your speed. Increase your speed. And then we're gonna take this. Over there. You are gonna need some of this. You're gonna want that. I don't think blight resistance does like anything to you. Now granted, we could, well actually, we could just get full damage. Lose max health. But I already gave you the speed steps. This is blight resist. Alright. Yeah. Everybody just get some extra HP. Everybody eat up. Any big combat item? We have some, but as much as we probably want. Let me look at relationships. How how are we looking? Wait, why is Boudicca unfriendly with everybody automatically? Because we're actually thrown. This would be like almost all of our money, at least 13. I mean, like, uh, too easy for that to go so poorly. E. About, we could even just increase. Right, we're gonna do that, and then pray Boudica doesn't ruin everything. Doesn't know how how to get along with others. Feed you up. You got Daredevil. What does that do? 10% extra damage. I'm going to start vulnerable. And if we miss, lose our stress. Oh. Well, I like that. Yeah. Need a combat item. Look at that. Yeah. Not perfect. Well, what about bobbles? Anything we want for bobbles? Trinkets. 20% damage. Disease resistance. I'm not going to buy this anyway. I don't know if I'm going to give it to him. sure. Okay. He's going to do almost 70% extra damage every turn. Hit the back line. We're gonna need her to hit the back line. We're gonna try and get you to taunt. You do highwayman things, although I'll still use you for your melee skill. There's still world. But I don't want duelist advance, I don't think. Take aim. I did want to go Grinch. Not point blank. Which one's better? Try this one. Rape shot. All right. What's her other skill? 
Nah, she like wins herself, which I can't deal with. And then here, I can't afford to fix any of that, but I don't think that happens. The inevitable end of your journey awaits. Oh. Once again. Here we go. We could pack it up, go back safely, and get a whole bunch of stuff, but nay! Didn't come all this way for nothing. Please be that can't be positive. Each covets what the other has. Please. Okay. Plots to take it. Oh, okay. All right. Tried and tested. What are the skills? A bomb to be counted on. Ain't no way. The one ability I'm using her for, of course, will stress Highwayman every single time. Incredible. You guys will at least buff each other. You use that a lot. You don't use that. It could be worse. It could be worse. It could be better, but it could be worse. The mountain. Oh lord, I don't know what to do. Temple of failure and regret. Oh, I'm regretting things. Regretting, um... Oh, well, first off, the fact that I did not reposition. What can he not use? Nobody will use Fade the Black. We'll do that for first. And then... Maybe I do Duelist Advance just... That I could reposition him without him needing to do it? Nah. Alright, so we have to fight another one of those cosmic things first. Before we go into the mountain. Of course. Hopefully that all goes well. Am I going to heal again? Do we heal again? We heal here? Okay, we heal. Alright. So we need this to be clean. Of course, we're going to fight. Again. What did I do? Also, the relationship things at this point don't really matter, but... Okay. You be fast. Jesus God is nice. I might want to be careful about doing this right now. Do not stress. Hmm. This. I don't really want to do that. Um, nah, screw it. We're stressing. Oh, but he heals every time we do that. Wait a sec. And I can guarantee the heal. Wait. I might be on something. Hold on. I'm going to have to let me cook. I want to bleed you back. Nice crit. And a burn. Now you watch yourself there. What you going to do? Of course, it's healing. I can't steal. Uh, I could stun you. All right, we stunned. That's big. That is not good. So many debuffs. Seven. Empowered. Emboldened. Uh, I could slow you guys, but already pretty slow. I think place to taunt. Although I don't want to guard. Maybe I'll taunt anyway. Nope. All right. Seventeen damage. Okay. How in the world is Highwayman faster? It's not good. You might be like, oh sweet dude, no. Not good, dude. I just buff myself. All right, nine open vein here. Oh, holy. all right. Big. Collaboration confers advantage. Do I just bleed again? 
Ready with eight defeat. Move forward. Blind. Now we do that. Hopefully blind works. Please? Wait, how's that even possible? He had dodge. There should be a 100% chance to miss. Oh my word. There's 22 casual damage. He's going to be dead before we even enter the fight. Right on all that. What in the world? In vain. I'm just gonna make sure you're dead. The work continues. Okay. The damage. Okay. No idea, but... Combo. So that's in something. Crisis. We can rely only upon each other. Whack you for here. Oh, the respectful double hit. Oh, oh we dodge those and we repost those. Wish we had some way to heal you. I, I really do. Yeah, I need to kill this now so everyone stops getting hit from their debuffs. Alright, well, we beat it, but it would have been fine if Hooser Face didn't take 80 bajillion damage from the start. I don't think we heal that much. Can you check combat item? This heals barely. Instead of the blind, I guess. Who blind is? All right, once more into the breach. This is it. I mean, give me like two more heals, please. Okay, I'll just take one. The okay. Cathedral. All right, I'm being greedy. One more, please. The Iron Crown. Please, one more heal. One more heal. I don't know if that counts as moving. One more heal. One more heal. All right. All right. Welcome to whatever the fudge this thing. I don't actually know what this thing is. Avatar of ill-concealed rage. Okay. So, well, it's immediately starting the mechanics. I can show you. Uh, this dude hurts a whole bunch, but here's what's going to happen. He builds up his breath on one of the sides of his lungs, sometimes both. You'll see it here, breath. It'll give him a new attack, which just hits everybody for a mega damage. You always need to stop it. And we have, what, three turns to do it? All you have to do is hit a threshold. But when I did this, the problem was I didn't have like anything to hit this, so I could never break the threshold. You can probably see the problem. Uh, immediately resist the bleed. In fact, oh, the, the lungs literally resist like everything. So this should do 13 to That should break it. Okay, it broke the threshold. So we're popping off. Now I'm going to use this time to hit you with some debuffs. Because we don't have to kill the lungs, we have to kill this main thing. But if we break these, it means it can't sigh and it makes it a little, a little bit easier in that regard. But I think I'm going to start uh, the bleeds here. Ideally. Okay, see, lots of dot damage. We love that. And then I'm going to prepare a crit in case he needs to hit the uh, back or whatever. Not too worried about the front. Love you going for him. Big fan of that. Keep that up. Um, in fact, I'm just going to go ahead and taunt. Don't worry about getting armor with Hysteria. See, we got some armor. Oh, we're fine. All right, so we're going to breathe it. So now we need to hit the front. Which, again, I don't really know how... Managing the... 
first, but uh, this will hit both. We didn't hit it, but not worried about it. We should hit that just fine. We're gonna do this again. He resisted the bleed. I know he'd resist everything else, but uh, hit him with the gabagoo. All right, and we broke the breath. Means I can go back to just whacking. Hopefully blinding, hog, and comboing. And now give myself extra armor. And he should hit us twice. So as long as we stop the breath, no AoE attacks as far as I'm aware. But as soon as he starts popping those out, everybody gets hit. It's miserable. But this, as it stands, what we need to do, and it's working. Okay, they did the front, which is fine. Still lots of damage. Probably breaks it, to be fair. Yeah, broke it. I think it is like 15. Exactly. Uh, I could take your armor. Probably better because the damage I'd be doing isn't anything to write home about. It. Anyway. I'm not too worried about stress right now. And that they all pop off. I feel like I should protect somebody. Uh, I could slow them, but they're already pretty slow. I'm just gonna go for more taunts to be safe. And I don't know if it, when I repost if I heal the combo. No, it doesn't work. Either. And I just got a taunt back. And another Tom back, so. Sounds good, but now I need to watch the stress. Build a front lung, so that's okay. Manageable. That's probably not enough to break it. Oh, it is. Wow. Well, then. Get you both. Would be doing more damage if he's in melee mode, but. Really want it then, but I also don't want you stressing out too much. Like, blah, 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 blah. Uh, let's heal a little bit. Combo. That's okay. If he's able to keep the attention the whole time, although. Stress do be building up a bit quicker than we can do because that turn or that attack does also have a cooldown. I'm gonna do it every other turn. The front one again. See, I thought it would keep doing the back one, but oh, that's not enough. However, the grape shot should do it. No, I wouldn't. Um. Let me make sure I can grape shot from. Yeah, I can. But I'm probably gonna blind it in combo. And then grape shot. Boosh! We're popping off. Okay, nobody's taunted. Oh no. Come on, buddy. Oh! That's what we're talking about! Resolute. In crisis, My dude's popping off. Only upon each other. He'll get freaking blinded, bro. Holy, that's huge. That alone could have been the difference. But he pops off when we need him most. Uh-oh. Okay, so now we have to pop both. Ash. Okay, that's the first one. Okay, all right, then I think we're okay. This ain't gonna do nothing. All right, now you gotta hit that, dude. Okay. I don't like the double thing. Not a fan of that. All right, now we need you to pump. Fine, you're fine. Crit, but you eat those. You just resisted eight million things. I'm so proud of you. 
If it starts doing this every round, can start with a problem. We just need to make sure always pop that one in one hit. Everything else sort of falls in place after that. Um, this this gives Barristan dodge, but I don't want to go back. That only hits you. I'm not chancing. It. It means we're doing less damage. Oh, pause to the um main dude, but I don't know what to do about that. Speed up actually probably screws us. Didn't think about that. That's why he's been acting faster. Alright. Alright. 16 damage to him like that? Okay. What are we? We're half health? Just gotta keep it up, lads. Okay, only one this time. Alright. Gotta say, big fan of that. That crit might be enough. Oh, the threshold must be 12. Oh, I'm gonna not waste my damage. Eh. Nah, well, does Barristan need to rebuff or something? Maybe. Would just be good for... Yeah, it's just... Ah, but that ruins the crit. Point is, it's hurt. I can move in. Give dodge. Crit. Oh, God. Oh. Yes, she now. He's vibing. Get some more taunts. Repost. Got a super dodge. Find rage. Stupid. I don't... Why is he gaining block, though? That's... You know, but we break it immediately. All right, man at arms is hard carrying. All right, we're back to the double long. Not my favorite, but... Prepared for this. Huge break. And we do it again. Don't chance it. In the Gabriel. Brilliant conclusion. Mm -hmm. I just keep giving myself armor. Although I could start healing. A little bit. I think I'll do that. Right, we're fine, we're fine. One more. All right. Okay. That health is starting to get low. If it would stop doing both lungs, we would probably have time to actually focus it down, but that's just the thing. Oh, 33 damage crit. Oh, jeebus. Yeah, do not mind if I do. Now he should be able to help finish that off. Big crit. I don't actually know what happens if we kill both lungs. I only ever killed one. And it just keeps going. It's just easy. The problem was I killed the front one, and then it was back every single turn, and then that's... Yeah, got in trouble. Uh, I'm gonna keep taunting, though. We just got you to keep taking the hits for us, buddy. Otherwise, we're gonna get in trouble. However, don't reduce damage right now. Both again. We can do this. Another crit! Holy crap! Yeah, I won. Yeah, I won then. Okay. Now we'll go back. Huge crit. Wait, these lungs are almost done for? Ooh, oh no, are you on? Oh no. I gotta do this. Oh, but now it could hit anything. Dodge! Oh. Wait, what is it doing? What was that? 
the boss. So what's going on with this face? Is this new? Did it evolve? I can't tell. Yo, another crit would be nuts. <gasps> what? Two HP. Ain't no way. Oh, I was hoping you would crit again. There we go. Okay. That lung's almost done for. Now, unfortunately, he did not get to uh, heal. I guess I could have hit one of those for the combo. But just hoping he can take enough damage from these two attacks. Anxiety He's still alive. You're nuts, my dude. Fears. Okay, we can do this. Again, I'm scared if we kill both lungs, it's going to start doing something new. But I haven't the slightest idea. There's one long. Stupid. Oh, wait. You get another chance? Alright. Well, now I can... Oh, wait. You're still going to do... Oh, Grape Shot's fine, though. All right, blind, which is huge. Grape shot. Lost both its lungs. Now, again, I'm a little afraid of what's going to happen now. In crisis, Death Storm. We can rely There's nothing we can do about on it. Each other. You've served as well as you... Oh, wait, wait, no, no, no. I can heal. Nobody missed. <sighs> oh, no, no, no. You resist. You're insane. You gotta do it again, though. Oh, when you might have a meltdown. Oh my god. Okay, wait, wait. Oh, but he's having another meltdown. That's fair. I wouldn't blame you, buddy. Your relationship with everyone's down, but that's alright. We don't need it to be on the up and up. Extra damage. 11. Oh, it had armor. Of course it did. Thank you. It gives us a combo. Uh, I literally don't think I can... St oh, there is a small chance I could stun you. Imagine. No. It wouldn't be cool. I also probably should have kept that so I could have healed. Just... Nice thing. Keep going out on top, buddy. You do have a superior dodge? Oh, but you taunted. Oh, you poor thing. With a superior dodge. Not only did it go through dodge and went through death block. Oh my word. Okay, you're popping off though. What the fuck? Come on. Come on. What what is even more damage, man? Miss! Oh, you're blind, you boner. Oh my word. Two damage away. Ain't no way. Oh, a crit. Ain't no way. Oh, and he's going to melt down. You're popping off my dude. Ooh. Absolutely insane. Oh, it's a death story. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. What is his death resistance? 33%? Doesn't matter. It's dead. I thought that would really do it. Uh, I don't have anything that ignores it. Dead! Oh. Alright, fine. I'm gonna bleed it. Just to make sure. Oh! Your in your furies, but in thinking they would accept such a fate. Oh my god. Resentment purged, baby. Woo! We had no right. Especially after we lost the healer, the occultist. The I thought we were done for. Shablam! From the darkened corners of the earth. Holy cow, uh, give me all the candles. Oh yeah! Wait, what the punch? My last one. A lot of candles. And a success. Oh yeah! I was totally prepared to do this run and lose. Didn't think it would actually be the run. Yeah, what's happening? Within hours, the entirety of our effort lay in a smoldering ashen heap. I braced against your rancorous buffeting, 
avowing a certain hesitant relief at our freedom from that mocking sigil. The uncanny arrival of the latter, however, heralded a new, pernicious phase of our investigation. Yeah. Holy. We did it. The Altar of Hope. Yada. Yada. And something that we can do they have to hold on to. is if anybody ends up surviving, you can upgrade them a little bit. Or something like that. I don't actually know. Okay, so you can use candles. So you get, you know, movement resistance, blight resistance. It's something. We have to defeat that boss. But it's sort of insane because... Once I use them, if they die, that's it again. So essentially, like, if I wanted all of them, I would have to literally, um, like, beat them all, which is pretty insane. But I know that I'm gonna go celebrate good times. Come on! Now, granted, the world's still depressing, and you know, darkness is gonna be nice, and blah blah blah. And there's still three more. But that that was that took me a long time. I'm glad we could share that experience together.